Hey everyone, I'm Calvin. I'm Derek. I'm Tobin. And it's four days before Halloween. Or as, how, how, as I like to call it, Holler Scream. Oh, it's the 31st of Shocktober. And we got the spookiest games yet. Starting with Resident Evil 4. Let's get it popping. Wii edition. I would say this game is nice and spooky. I, uh, I would never. I would not say this game is is full on scary. Yeah, well, and this I've, is part of the experiment. Is Calvin's never played? this. I've never played it before. Yeah, you know, somebody on my Facebook was asking me, "Hey, are you gonna play any more Resident Evil 4 this year?" And I was like, "We already. I did that numerous times yeah. last year. I think even earlier this year." What about Calvin? This game got a strong line of scene of explicit violence and gore. Whoa! And it's by Capcom. <laughs> Why? The worst Curtis of all. <laughs> Back when Capcom made really good games. So, uh, this is my copy of the, the Wii version. It is the third version of Resident Evil 4 that I own. I had the GameCube exclusive when it came out. Yep. Uh, and loved that. Played through it three or four times. Oh, yeah. Then they had the PlayStation port with exclusive extra content. Oh, yeah. So I had to get that. Oh, yeah. And then they upgraded the visuals and made it Wii adaptable. And I think there's a couple of... <clears throat> special things exclusive to the Wii still. Sure, I mean, there's this bonus video. Was, was, oh, wow. <laughs> oh, man. Rating Send pending. the kids home. That was almost rest Wee. in peace. Oh, dear. Ratings in pending. <laughs> oh, yes. You also brought this game. Oh, yeah, totally yeah. happened in my bag. This <laughs> outbreak incident. You know, I got one of those, like, Wii... Like guns, because there's the zapper gun, which is a piece of crap. I don't want to yeah. hold this. What is that? But it was just this Resident cartridge that you Evil slide your Wii remote into it. It's basically a gun. You're like one of like the Mad Cats or whatever. Yeah, I think it's like not Nokia, but something that sounds like Nokia. Um, great. Ninety-eight. Really, really good. Is it? Is it it's literally like Nikea, isn't it? Like with a Y. Yeah, I think so. But it's 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 mountains. perfect. It's great. So and I got it used for like five out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the International Pharmaceutical We're Enterprise. We're good. We good? Just tell us in the chat if our audio needs to be. Yeah. Yeah. Let us know. Oh, I pressed the button on accident. Skip the cutscene. Oh, he was talking about Calvary. the PC version. I think the PC version was like real shit when it came out. And in a sense, uh... I, yeah, there's like a new PC version. Uh, you're here to find the president's daughter who's in, uh, Spooksylvania for some reason. <laughs> well, yeah, I shot that bird. Un un unnamed, uh, European country sure. that uh, apparently is near the uh, Caribbean, we'll find out later in the game. <laughs> Forget your makeup or something? Oh! Because you're a pretty boy. Those are <laughs> real cops. Forget your makeup or something? Damn! Damn, rude. Rude. Just got put on blast. All right, but what if yeah, I... Yeah, the Nyko gun. Okay. Shoot him? No, that's what I'm going Get this over with, will you? Aw. I can't shoot him. So me and Derek were talking just before we went live on here. I was saying, I think the Wii version might be the best version of this game, but at the very, uh, I guess, best, or at, at least, like, the controls actually end up making a lot of sense. Like, there's a lot of games that came to Wii where it was like, do we really need to, like, point and waggle and all that? And this one, just because the way the aiming works with your over the shoulder Yeah, and it was like, stuff. it was like naturally. Like, I think, yeah. you know, even you and I were both big fans of this game, and when they announced the Wii one, yeah. I don't know about you, but I was like, yeah, no, yeah. What? of course. It's great. And it actually makes the shooting a lot, I was going to say easier, but more refined, more accurate. Because yeah. otherwise you're trying to move, like, your little, like, this has a cursor before it was just the red dot. I think. Yeah, which um, with a joystick. Kind of coming back to that red dot uh, is really, really faint. Um, I will sing the praises of this game for ages, but yeah. it, it, you know, like most classic games, this uh, is ten years me. old uh, in January. Sir, not the best aged game, really. Just a regular villager. Calvin. Yeah, it's just a regular villager. He's hanging out. Just a regular ass villager. Don't understand English because you're not in America, so that's fine. <laughs> why would, this picture? Why would he respond to you? You seen this president daughter? So sweet, I was wondering if you might recognize a, a girl in this photograph. Sorry to bother. Latin. <laughs> I did a cool ninja roll. Freeze! I said freeze! So you, might, you might have to do stuff here. I'm ready to shoot him. 
And then when they stumble back like that, you run away. Kick them. Oh, someone move the truck. truck. We're out of here. We heard those gunshots. That's spooky. We're spooky. Oh, also, I think this game is like full frame. Let's say the GameCube version had like really thick bars. Letterbox. Yeah. yeah. Kind of like a certain Shit. game made by the same guy. Shinji Mikami, we're, up catch, we're on to you. You like black bars. <laughs> You're addicted. Is everything okay? There was a hostile local. No. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head right toward now, the actually. village. Yeah, Take whatever measures necessary to There's save the There's a point the in the game, like at the very Understood. end, where she takes her glasses off for, I don't know, for no reason, whatever. But Leon's like, hey, took your glasses off. Like, how would he. This game's dumb. He sees the picture. I got that gold. He's got like one of those Dick Tracy watches. He's not, he's not a zombie. I remember that was a big part of like the marketing for this, is like, they're not zombies. Like, uh, I but mean, then the big, big, big part of the marketing for Resident Evil 6 was, they are zombies. zombies. We brought them back, we swear. They're zombies now. As much as I love this game, and I will even say Resident Evil 5 has its merits, it's not scary, uh, but like, it's a pretty fun, especially co-op, it's actually really fun. Does that mean you guys are gonna make fun of me if I get spooked? Well, I mean, if we well, ever play Resident yeah. Evil 5 and you get spooked uh, by, like, racist caricatures. Uh, yeah, let's... But uh, I never even touched 6. No, I, I ended up buying it for a uh, couple of bucks. And it's just sitting on my shelf collecting dust, like, just one day I played. And did they have co-op in that one, too, or...? Nope. Might at certain points. <laughs> no. What? Nope. Whoa. 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 Oh. I was trying to move while, while aiming, and that doesn't work. What's the quick turnaround button? Uh, back and run. Oh. You're playing on easy. Oh, you're playing on, on normal. I got him. Uh, but yeah, when you when you if you shoot okay. a guy in the head like that and they kind of like turn around and stumble back, you run up on him and hit. It, it'll basically be a contact sensitive. It might just be A or whatever. Yeah. Uh, but you'll do like a cool. Ninja kick or you know and that's suplex a, and, him or and something. That is less about like doing lots of damage and more of like just clearing the air, getting yeah. some space. And also saving Sorry, some I had to ammo. touch your yeah. arm, Calvin. Why would I'm spooked? Ah. Uh, Wee. People are talking about the Evil Within, and, and and we were just bringing up the mention of like Resident Evil Five was really an action game. Go check on your top, and it seems like the conversation with the Evil Within is like. Man, it's really hard to make an action game and a scary game. Mm -hmm. And I've heard Ooh. that they have done that with Evil Within with uh, mixed Ooh. results. Dude, kill my cop buddy. I'm really looking forward to playing that though, but I'll probably yeah. do it like on PS3. Oh, that's gonna look. That and Alien Isolation, no. I really want to no. play too. Uh, Derek, who's our homie from this game who uh, in the helicopter? Mike. Mike. Oh, Mike. Shout out Mike. Shout out to Mike. He knew a good bar. <laughs> He knew a good bar. He knew, he knew all the good bars. Yeah, we wanted firepower, and that's what he delivered, you know? Yeah. God, I need to inform you. The people in the chat are already, like... They mean it right now? They're expecting you to do something very soon. Am I going to get spooked? Did, they, did, they, do, do, do not let them down. Is it save the dog? That's a safe game, Cal. Oh, okay. you can do that if you want. Like that. That's. How you? Just type this. I'm a good typist. Oh, Derek, we were talking about controls earlier, and this is this is the first Resident Evil game I actually played to completion Whoa. and and enjoyed playing from a control standpoint. Yeah. But I remember, like in high school and stuff, yeah. people were like, "No, I mean that's part of like the." That's part of the, it helps build the tension in Resident Evil is that it controls terribly. Was their basic argument? It's like, oh, well, you know, like, if you could aim smoothly, like, you wouldn't be as scared of these zombies and stuff. I'm like, I think that's a terrible excuse. I'll help you, dog. Save the dog, Calvin. Like, you, you could do other things oh, to make a me, game spooky or build let, tension. Let me, let, me yeah. a, let me put a band-aid on it. Let me put a band-aid on it. Well, and that, that like, Resident, Resident Evil kind of laid the groundwork and, you know, yeah. was really, really, really good. Yeah. Silent Hill is the yeah. scarier game by right. an Olympic mile. I think the original Silent Hill, uh, you know, PlayStation 1 graphics and all, is still one of the scariest games ever made. The, the, the truth about Resident Evil is that, like, the tank controls and, like, the snapping camera, that was all just a workaround because yeah. 
you know, it was, it was 96. Right. Like, Polygonal what Gaming was super, down? super early, and, like, they didn't, like, the first Resident Evil was gonna be, like, a... I think it was gonna be a first-person perspective remake of Sweet Home in its earliest uh, incarnation, and was gonna be a co-op game, like, through the uh, Link cable, and they were like, nah, ditch all that. And so, right. they were able to adapt to what the hardware was, a, was able to at the time, but, like, yeah. you know... The first Resident Evil, like, fine, but by the time we got to, like, 2 and 3 and Co-Veronica, it was like, why are we still using this, yeah. uh, uh, this control scheme? It's really old and antiquated. And I had some friends who were really into Resident Evil 4, mm -hmm. and I was like, oh, I have, the, I have the older games, you should play them. And, uh, he was like, no, I can't. Like, the tank controls, the, the awful, I cannot. He's like, I'm gonna be Resident Evil 4 and on, and I'm not even going back. Oh, hey. I didn't see that. No big deal. Hey. <laughs> Better find... No, she's right there. Well, that's not the president's daughter. That's just, that is just one of the... the villager moms. Rude. Yeah, that animation you can go up front of the table. Nice. Get him. People in the chat saying Calvin ain't real gamer because he ain't using the knife. You see my dude using the knife? Watch this. Stay here. Watch this. See that? Cut him off. Wow. Whoa, 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 MLG. And then I got the ammo, and then I got the ammo? You got bodied. How do I reload? Getting bodied all the time. Is there a way to reload? Point off screen and shake it? Oh. Uh, no, it's... Uh, put put your gun up, but instead hit run. Uh, nope. Any button except shoot. Try that. Then you are out of ammo. Oh, that might, you might be down to your last three. No, I just picked up another ammo box. Well, that's, that's, there, there's two guns. There's the run button. And there's I got ammo the, right the, there. We'll combine them. You, you can do that. You, I don't think you can reload on screen. On the menu screen here. Yeah. Oh, man. What, what's... what? It's been a while. What, what, is, what, what is shoot? Uh, A. Okay. What is run? Uh, uh, this trigger. So you should, you should pull your gun out and use the trigger. I just, I just did that. And then try every button pull, except for Pull the gun out. Yeah. Or was it just... It was just on the... Oh, I just on the D-pad. Or right, yeah. was it But down. yeah, you gotta have your gun out to... Mm -hmm. See, like, I think this game's controls are still... Planning. Kind of restrictive enough without making it play bad. Where it's like, you know, the stop and shoot type stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got spooked. <laughs> Oh. oh my god. God. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> you <laughs> Damn it. need to. <laughs> yeah, you can. Uh, Center box, there we go. You gotta get some weed on you. No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think in most games, I'd be complaining about the design of, like, just a really kind of muted uh, color scheme with, like, Everything's brown and green and like kind of like dull, including like character yeah. characters. And this is before Unreal Engine and uh, uh, Gears of War. So what? the but point it, of boxes if there's nothing in them. Uh, Schro Schrodinger's ammo. Yeah, you never know. Sometimes maybe there's a chicken egg in there. Sometimes okay. scissor man's in the maybe box. There's a chicken egg. In, maybe there's a chicken egg in your butt. Oh, I'm not a chicken though. <laughs> exactly. Um, are, aren't you? <laughs> or aren't you aren't a chicken? Mr. Scaredy Pants over here. <laughs> Getting scared all the time. <laughs> But I think like all the muted yeah. colors and stuff kind of works where like villagers kind of blend in, so it's like yeah, at a first glance you might not see where all the characters are oh, coming from. Oh, it's hold the gun out and shake it. Oh, oh yeah. Or press the control pad. Oh, okay. I wonder if also that was another kind of workaround because this game was built on the GameCube right. and the character models are, are the animations and, and all of that are pretty damn good for this game. Yeah. Uh, a lot of that ages really really well. But I wondered they had to choose a really kind of drab palette to right. fit it all on, you know, those tiny, tiny discs. Mini discs are the future, Derek. I rented, um, there's actually a rental joint here in town. It's crazy, you can still rent video games, but there's a local place. And I rented um, a GameCube game, and the woman there... I found the chicken. The woman there, like, when she was pulling it out, was like, Do you have this game? Is this a... Is this a game? It's a full what game? Is this? She could not believe yeah. that the GameCube disc was... She didn't know what it was. She was incredulous that it really yeah. was a game. 
Oh, okay. All right, so this this is the real deal, Calvin. Pull out your sniper rifle. Start popping them. Headshots. Oh, head pop, pop. Oh, uh oh. There's actually a place off to the left. Check that pile of wood. There's. Uh, uh, should be a herb hidden in there. Yep. I've always thought a good place to start was is in that box next to that woman. Is a red herb. Oh, you got spotted though. I always go and kill that woman back there as to uh, to start this. Shoot! Yes. Get them headshots. Good. Kicked her. No. Damn it, there's a dude on the roof throwing shit at you. Yeah, I I played it for PS3. Oh, Yo, that is an upscale DS game. Yep. Um, what, what the thing, like it's not bad at all, but like it's not like, anything special. I don't know. I, I would say that the no. the single player <laughs> the single player story is a means to an end, and that end is the raid mode. Yeah. Which I thought was super fun. Uh, one of the things that drives me crazy in that though is probably because it's the scale of the S game is uh, most character most enemies don't react to being shot. Yeah, they just they just punch it up and keep coming. And like I love like it's stuff you take for granted in this game. It's like, oh I shoot this guy in the shoulder, it's gonna affect my shoulder. If I shoot him in the foot, he's yeah. gonna fall over. You know that's still one of the things about gold that I think is, is I can come back to and enjoy that game is like all the guns have animations, you can see the cartridge fly out, there's tracers for the bullets, and when they hit the enemy they react accordingly. And so even though that game is, is old and janky as hell, it kind of gets like the fundamentals of that gunplay uh, in a video game, right? I, I still think that game's super good. Calvin, I'm gonna block that door. Uh, check that. There should be a grenade in there. Oh no! <laughs> You want to run to that corner and do a quick 180, and you want to heal up. I think it's, I think it's one more leaf. Yep. Yes. Yep. Guys, I'm good at video games. I, I would say uh, it's totally okay dying at this place. This is part of the game. It's kind of rough, actually. Oh no. Nice. nice. And was it in five that they did away with the the uh, item menu screen? It was just like a overlay, you know, like a yeah. pop up. And I thought that was really cool um, because one of the things in this one, if I was getting not too spooked but overwhelmed, I could just like hit that menu screen, like okay, combine these items, da da da, do this, 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 and then come back, you know, recollect myself. Whereas in five, for all its other kind of issues, like I appreciate like it kept you in the game. So is it just that I just have to hold them off for long enough? Yeah, there's a certain amount of, of dudes you have to kill. Uh, I think there's a red, yeah, there's a red leaf there. This was nothing. Um, I think there's a, to your right, is the golden leaf. And you combine that with the leaf, and then it'll uh, raise your max HP. Alright, so if I combine the red and the gold? It won't, you need a green to do anything yeah. with either of those by themselves. So combine them together. Oh, okay. I, but I think you can use a yellow by itself. And you get a little bit of health along with it, but it also increases it. It's best to combine it with a... Uh, did I kill everyone? I, guys, I killed no. everyone. I killed everyone. I'm the did. best. I was gonna say, like, yeah, there's some ladders and stuff. Ah, here. Yeah, you got them. Oh, do yourself a favor and maybe don't go in that house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a minute. You should throw a grenade. Oh, man. A grenade? You should, yeah, you should let them kind of get close to you. Yeah, and just toss that on. grenade, motherfucker. Well, yep, I love did. that fire animation. That's good. Your, you motherfuckers are all on fire. Oh, that green thing. That's health. That's a green. That's a health item. Oh, <laughs> I can't move at the same time. You're telling me, kick. Yeah, see, that's a nice thing. It affects both of you. Yeah, don't go in that house though. Just don't go in the house. Oh, he doesn't want to go in that house. Just let me go in the house. You can go in the house. I think you can find that clock tower. Right? Yeah. Uh, you might want to. Oh, no. I mean, you... Uh, 
I would combine all three of this. All right. So combine. Am I giving you too much help, dude? I'm sorry. Nah, nah, that's fine. All right, all right. I'm, I'm bad at video games. Wait, I didn't want to examine. Combine with this. Mm -hmm. Use it. Yeah, that health bulb. I'm stronger than ever. Oh, all right, don't go that. Oh no. Oh, you can go in that room there. I think that that's a safe dwelling. And I think you can even like. Lock that door. Lock the yeah, door. I think, I think there's ammo in there. Get on the other side of that door. Yeah, door. you can push it. Oh wait, on that, that, that one. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, push, push. And I guess if you didn't want to use the uh, motion controls, you can plug in a classic yeah. uh, and play this game. Like the, uh, the original. That's that's something. I like how it was like, oh, I need to reload. Yep. Oh, no, it's like the old like kind of arcade shooters. But just how silly it looks to wiggle it. Yeah. <laughs> There's a uh, knife that. Wait. And with the doors, you can open them like that, or if you like double tap, it'll kick it open, which is always handy if there's someone on the other side. Listen, the champ is just being modest. Listen, he's actually very good at video games. He's just. Right, you know. Oh no, I do want to take those shotgun shots. You need a shotgun, but yeah, there's a shotgun around here, I think, right? There is. Uh, it's, it's in the house, and I recommend. Well, now that he has some shotgun, extra shotgun shells. <laughs> just uh, all right. Okay, uh, you're gonna want to kick that door open on him, and then we'll knock him all back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh no! Take that. Someone tricked me out. I mean, they're gonna come in anyways. No. I want to oh, kick it. Come on in. Oh, you almost got guys. this. Kick him! Yeah! Kick all you motherfuckers! Reload! Uh... Oh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> well... Oh no! This is the end of Leon Kennedy. Okay, so next time if you get one of them and kick him, then you, you just try and run past him. Yeah, you need to get the fuck out of there. But you should be almost... No, I'm just gonna hold up. Yeah! I wanna heal? I have no ammo. Take that, you could just... Okay, all right. Let's just use that. Gonna be fine. Calvin's gonna be fine. Oh. Oh, Well man. done. Well Jesus. done. Oh, you did it. It's all of it. So if you would have gone in that house, Ooh. that is where the shotgun is. But that, is that where the chainsaw is? that spawns the chainsaw guy. Yeah. So Which like... is, if we want to spook Calvin, is what we should have done. Because that guy, that guy is... Like, it's a pretty generic design, but like... Just madman running at you Lord, with a chainsaw unwield unwieldy. So, and also I, he, that those guys take our pain in the ass takedown. Can I, can I go in there now? Yes. Okay. Shh, shh, shh. Where's everyone going? Bingo? <laughs> Damn! Damn! <laughs> and then it's just a bingo. <laughs> it's just Resident Evil Bingo. bingo. He's basically Dante. So that is seriously one of my favorite spoken like, lines in a video game. I just look like the Michael Bay the body of an office. Yeah. Something's happened. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm here to play video games, not read a book. Ugh. All right, so this house is Shotgun House. So it's called the Shotgun House. Oh, yeah, people t people talking about Clutch, the Champ, Bingo Time. <laughs> this was a crazy moment, though, seeing this was what they would show in, in, like, a press at the time was Leon coming into this house and then him, like, the, that cutscene and then him pushing the bookcase in front mm -hmm. and then, you know, eventually, like, the, the chainsaw guy will just break the whole thing down. Yeah. Um, and that that's pretty scripted. Every time. I, for I for the time, that was a really, like, an intense and crazy, like... Yeah. Like, oh my god, they're really doing well, and, like, next the level shit with this. I think the music changes and gets way more intense with the, uh, the chainsaw guy. It's just really uh, unsettling. Does it, or just like chainsaw sounds? Oh not yeah, no. Fun. I don't think the music yeah. actually. Just, yeah. Yeah. And right before he uh, strikes at you, He's he got, like, a yells. Creepy laugh. And... My friend, I might have mentioned this on another uh, time we played Resident Evil Four. Uh, spoke the language oh, of the native up. people here, it's... and I, I, I think it's a. I, I don't want to say because I don't know a fucking thing about it. Um, but for a second, I thought you were talking about Alaska. I was like, these people of Alaska don't speak Spanish. No, what are you no, talking no. about, Derek? 
<laughs> he was not a native Alaskan. He was born in Alaska like us, but not a, not a native Alaskan like you, Calvin. But he was saying like playing this game was, was actually really fun because they will say things like, I'm gonna get you, or, I'm, or I'm right behind you, or grab her. Um, I like the, I'm right behind you. Yeah. I think like, yo hello is, is, is get him. <laughs> so yo hello, yo hello, or I can apologize if I'm really fucking that up. I think you Dr. Dre voice, you wanna play Halo? <laughs> Did you do much of the uh, like the trials or the challenges? In, yeah. In this? Yeah. Oh man, I, ne I never got the uh, mis mercenary mode. I never got the hand cannon. I think in that one of these bundles of woods has like a, I think a, a herb in it somewhere. I don't think I'm wrong. But it's always wrong. The mercenary mode, if you got five stars on mm -hmm. every level with every character, you got the hand cannon, which was this insane, one hit kill rocket launcher mm -hmm. thing. I never got that good at the game. I never played it quite that much. Yeah, and um, you know, I thought I don't think I got that far either. But you're getting getting five stars on all those levels is well because like on, on really this one, tough. there's like so many like multipliers and stuff. Calvin, no, you can do it if you want to. If you want to waste your ammo. burgers, got them burgers. You can't eat that meat, Calvin. What? Ruined. I think you can go in that. No, right that's that's blocked off. I mean, I, I was actually thinking, like, we got a lot of games to play. Just, and, and the point was just to give me a taste of Resident Evil. I like Resident Evil. Just... Yo, this is a hell of a game. Yep. This is a if hell of a game. you play it, you should play it. Um, I would say in the year 2014, the first Dead Space is probably a better playing game and an overall better experience. But, yo, do you like Gears of War or... Batman or like any third person game that's come out post 2005 this is where it came from so there's also that like this is an, an enormously influential game all right next game yeah switch it up switch it up so, I mean, speaking of the Resident Evil on person or on on rails first person shooter. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna play more Resident Evil, right? Yeah, we have to. We're gonna play some more Resident Evil. Yeah, we have to. Yeah, got it. But, you know, some version of Resident Evil got... Uh, not quite. Now, now, now listen. We want to we, we say thank you to the people that are watching us. <laughs> uh, but, but, yo, I'm not going to pretend like we got a billion people watching us right now. We're not the most famous place on the internet. We're not the most famous show on the internet. It's because we do dumb shit. <laughs> this, this is not how you get famous on the internet. You don't play the prototype Resident Evil unfinished, unreleased Game Boy um, Color game? I'm gonna need to reset real quick. Can you- Hold on. Resident Evil. Are we waiting for- Oh, some? is it- Oh. Music? It's not- it's not playing the sound. Is there music to- Is there some spooky music we're missing out on? No, there's a cool sound effect. Um... Oh, man. Man. But yes, um... Technical issues will probably happen. Damn. Uh, that may be the ROM. That may be I, the fact I, that this is an unfinished game. I heard it before. Game. Are we just... The stream might be getting sound and we just might not be getting sound, which oh, would be okay. annoying. Let me double check. Uh... <laughs> no, we are not going to play Resident Evil Gaiden. We are not. Wait, what? All right, hold on, let me... Uh... There, there was a Game Boy Color game called Resident Evil Gaiden. Let me test out something real quick. See if we're getting sound. You're on a... Boat? And you played as Barry and like it was like top it was like top down and occasionally had like this behind the back like a first person. Talked about in magazines for like maybe a year or so. It was an EGM and a couple other things. I remember being really stoked for it, but yeah, they made this. They were working on this game for a really long time, and then it got to a certain point. Um, pretty far along the road they shut the game off. And they kept said like, no. But they canceled it in the year 2000. So like Dreamcast was out. Yes. Xbox original was on the way, and uh, the Game Boy Advance. Testing one, two. The Game Boy Advance is coming out. So, 
it was it was a good choice by Capcom to maybe cancel this game. Oh, people saying way too loud. Yeah, and and part of the problem was. All right, but now we got audio too. Oh, did, did we? Was I just talking to nobody when the stream just went off? Maybe. <laughs> uh, the stream didn't go off. Our video went off, and, but maybe they couldn't hear it because of the music. All right, let's try this again. Okay, yeah. Let us know. Turn up those mics. These mics. Turn down for spooks. Somebody in English explain to us. Is that a professional voice actor? Or so, that... I mean, so Derek, do you want to play this one? Yeah, I'll play it. So it's arrow keys, Z and X for A and B, yeah. and return for start, pretty much. And that's all you need to... Oh, hold on, it's not showing up on the thing for some reason. There we go. Oh, give, give, us, a, give us a reset, Calvin. They need, to, they need to hear it with the context. Right. Uh... <laughs> and that, and that, is not, going? that is not even like a, a reproduction of the Resident Evil it's from the, that, it's some that new evil. thing that, I want a new game. Is this a new game? Which one start? Z and X are start and select? Uh, return is start. Aha, that's why. <laughs> So you got two choices. They've escaped into the mansion. Who? <laughs> they. Where they, they? Where they thought it was safe. However. Oh. Yet. Oh, oops. It's not. Oh, man. <laughs> oh. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Barry. Where's Barry. Well, I'm sorry, but he's probably... No! What is that? <laughs> I'll go and check. I can't okay. imagine Shut how up. much... Stay in the hall in case of emergency. ...hard work went into this game. Like... Look, like... Chris! <laughs> Take care! It's a good album. It's my favorite Drake album. <laughs> Nothing was the same. That's your plan. I will look at the chat. Yes. Now I'm gonna move my laptop to the. All right. All right. So this is Resident Evil. So I, I played a little bit of this before. Um, so those two. Um, so there's three or there's four hex values down there at the bottom. Uh, the first one is like which screen you're in, because you'll see that'll change as you change camera angles. Uh, the next two are your X and Y coordinates in that screen, I think. Oh, let's get the shotgun. Paused. You, you paused Stop. it. Which is select then? Uh, tab maybe? Uh, let me double check. I gotta go to my inventory and get my shotgun out. Or is there no... I think this game was far enough along to have a, a shotgun. Uh, well, I saw the shotgun was in my inventory, but I wouldn't be surprised there's actually no way to access the menu. Ooh, mouse. Uh, backspace. Okay. Bam. One. Let's check. Remington <laughs> MH70, powerful single loader. Okay, that smear of peanut butter is a shotgun. And people in the chat are pointing out, like, imagine playing this on, like, a screen, like, yeah. two inches by three inches. Impossible. Th th there is something to be said about the... How do I get out of here now? Uh, probably have to go up to exit. Uh, this, this is, this is a, a game of, of many. Like... But there like, are there are it. probably many games that like were like f either from just sheer stupidity and, and just brazen braveness, or from upon upon Mount High somebody said, "Make me a Resident Evil for the Game Boy." <laughs> <laughs> Can I be like? My, I want that as like a Twitter app. Oh my <laughs> god, that's beautiful. Get the zombie. <laughs> Classic Resident Evil. I'm sorry, is he just walking backwards and forwards? Did you get him? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, turn, turn! Get off this! <laughs> well... 
NASA store. <laughs> Guys, video games are awesome! <laughs> oh my god. Video games are so oh wonderful. Also, I thought I chose Jill. Didn't I choose yeah. Jill? Yeah. I'll choose Chris this time. Alright. <laughs> like, I wonder if it's just oh didn't get god. far enough along where it was like, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Oh. But like, the, the insane ambition of this game. Yeah. You have to, I, I admire like, it. It's like, it's doing like, Mode 7 style scaling. Like, if you look at how the pixels move. Like, this this is basically a Nintendo game. Okay, like this press, is the Game Boy Color. I think you should press start. You'll, you'll skip the cutscene. Nah. Oh, a space is fast forward. <sighs> Alright. So I guess it doesn't matter who you choose. Yeah. How was I running before? Oh. <laughs> you shouldn't run in this game. Go, go. Nope. Yep, yep. Uh. Yeah, look, it's like it's actually scaling the sprite. As like the further away you get. I found a document online uh, that I think is just an official pitch. I don't know if it ever uh, anything ever came of it, but somebody wanted to make Dino Crisis for the hey. Game Boy Color. Hey, buddy. Hey. His Pac-Man eyes. You don't have a gun, do you? Yeah, I want a pistol. There you go. Any Give me chomps. a hug, buddy. He chomps you. Got him. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> you got him. Uh. Did he, like, go kick him over or something? <laughs> he's dead. Oh. R Rigor Morgus, as they call it. That oh, way. He should have items on him. I like, the, I like the dead guy's body just kind of blended into the floor. <laughs> well, see you later. Now, how would you rate this music, Derek, on a spookiness level? You know what this music ain't bad. Go on the door. Go on the door. No. <laughs> no. Go on the door. Can't go on the door, Derek. Can't go on the fucking door. Was this game unfinished? <laughs> Can I go in this? I shouldn't be able to go in this door. Let's go in the door. Let's <laughs> go in the door, Derek. Go on the door! It's not me going on the door. Chris is gonna cooperate. Oh. There we go. That's that. Oh, that was me. I probably shouldn't be doing that. What they should have done is just remade Sweet Home on the Game Boy Color. Where did everyone go? Where'd the front door go? <laughs> Wesker? Jill? Hmm. What happened to Jill and Wesker? <laughs> it's like, hmm. hmm. O O two F F C C F F D four D F F E. This is supposed to be Jill's gun. I I can't seem to pick it up. Jill's meatloaf. <laughs> <laughs> Jill left her sock here. <laughs> this is her favorite sock. Her feet are get, will get cold. Oh, your cold feet. She'll catch cold. It's like rule number one to be a marine. In stars, you have warm feet. Oh. Just leave. <laughs> Peace. Nah. It should be a, a sock puppet dog could pop out and try and eat me. Uh, let's go upstairs and see what Forrest is up to. <laughs> Running seems really dangerous in this game. You run too far and you end up three screens somewhere else. <laughs> oh! What about this lava raining yeah, down? Yeah, stacking up these pizzas, baby! <laughs> this place got a lot of red towels. <laughs> this is an original song, this is not something that appeared in the uh. Any Resident Evil game? Wow, someone, someone pooped on the floor. <laughs> Who pooped on the floor? Someone spilled Nutella all over the carpet. Squesker, you poop on the floor again? No. no. <laughs> also, this would have been technically an M-rated Game Boy Color game. Whoa. Which, there had to have been a couple, but I could not think of them off the top of my head. If there are any M-rated 
Game Boy Color games. Whoop. Whoop. <laughs> Alright, buddy. No, no bazooka. <laughs> si no, si bazooka. See ya. no bazooka for you. No. The bazooka do. So Derek, is this layout like basically the same as the original? Yeah, game? this is a pretty good rendering of Resident Evil. As far as like all the look rooms and the hallways. It, exactly, no, it's like... exactly the same. It would, it would appear that the puzzles were there, you know, the clock thing was there, and the emblem was there. I'm, I'm not sure if uh, Moon Knight 123 is making a, a Vince McMahon joke. I'd like to believe it. He's saying, It was me, Wesker! <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> me all along. <laughs> Climbing down the lasagna. <laughs> I had all of stars fooled! <laughs> Canonically, I should not be able to get to the room where the dogs jump to the window, but let's see if we can. Now, I couldn't find a good download for it, but there is, like, patched versions of this ROM that, like, remove the few bugs. Well, the many bugs. Uh, and then you can, like, play through most of the game. <laughs> That's crazy. Because, at least in this demo, uh... Most of the mansion is uh, accessible. Oh man, they're going crazy in the chat. Barry bought it. Chris bought it. Even my immediate body bought it. <laughs> uh oh. Just look at this model. Girl, hey. just go look at that. Look at that body. Oh man. <laughs> I work out. Look at that butt. Oh man. This is a spooky hallway. It's a poorly colored hallway. Whoa, oh, 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 Zombo! They just sit Bow down. Bow down. They just sit down. They know who's boss. How do we render a, a zombie laying down? I don't know, man. Know, we'll figure that out after we pitch this to Capcom. Don't worry. <laughs> Everything's gonna go fine. Like, I wanna know, did did the people that made this game, were they serious? Like, no, we can make this fucking work. And did they put in, like, 16-hour days? We're like... Were wives eating dinner alone because their husbands were putting in overtime to finish Resident Evil for the Game Boy Color? Or is this like a fool's errand? Like a bunch of people were caught goofing around the office. Like, this team, you know what? For the next six months, you're working on Resident Evil for the Game Boy Color. Oh. No! Man, there's not even a giant bomb page for it. I want to say the existence of this ROM is like maybe two years old. This game has been known to exist since, like, at least 99. Yeah, the only Game Boy Color one they have is Gaiden. Or Gaiden. Oh! Thought I saw a zombie. I... that's not where I went. Ah, uh, that... Giant Bomb does not have a lot of info on it. It just says the Game Boy Color version was planned, but it was canceled, cited by Capcom to be of poor quality. I can't see. Wait. I'm on the other side of the rail. They did not render this corner, so I'm gonna try. Alright. Nope. No. <laughs> they got you. Yep, nope. They got you. Well, that's. Yeah. That's Resident Evil. There's that. <laughs> That's how it ends. I don't know what it is about that screen. Now and forever. Just you died and just him like, but. All right, well. That, but that's an accurate rendering of the death animation from Resident Evil. Now there's you, a, there's there's more to discover in this game. Uh, download it. I mean. Now you may be saying, oh, that's certainly all of the dumb stuff that the Space Bong and the Octagon can't has find in store. any more dumb stuff. Well, let nope. me uh, let me load up this Wonder Swan emulator. Oh. <laughs> And you, you got this running? Confirmed? It's uh, arrow keys, return and start, and then X and C. So like one key over for what you were okay. using before. Clock tower for the Wonder Swan, ladies and gentlemen. Who fucking knew? <laughs> I found this out like literally Saturday. I texted Calvin like, you have to see if you can get a Wonder Swan working on the stream. Because we need to play clock tower for the Wonder Swan. Uh, oh yeah, excuse me. Let's just, let's get into it. Let's do it. 
So what, this was like, was the Clock Tower originally like Super Nintendo? Yes, it is a point and click game. All right. All right, so I, all right, you can run. I, I guess I just wasn't doing it, or I, I did it before like the game actually properly started. Yeah. It's like, you can't run in this one. Uh, You're fucked. Oh, let's see. I think, I mean, it looks, this is... to, to, to my eye, as someone who didn't play a lot of Super Nintendo 1, it looks like that one just without color. <laughs> Kanai, I'm not sure what that verb is, but I think that the, the Kanai means a negative connotation of a verb, so probably I cannot open it. Is Amy in the chat? <laughs> Can Amy help us out? Oh, I don't see no. Amy. All right. Amy knows what Wonder Swan. Amy owns a goddamn Wonder Swan. Shout out to Amy. Goodness. And I, and I, I, I think she was at least looking at a, yeah. a, uh, a lot of game comms and Resident Evil 2 for the game com. Mm -hmm. Do not believe she wouldn't bought them though, which I, is probably fine. I really want to check out Uzumaki for the for the Wonder Swan, because it's the only like Uz, like Uz, for those who don't know Uzumaki is like a horror manga by uh, Junji Ito, which is really cool and about spirals and crazy shit. Oh no, um, no, it's fine. <laughs> so it's the only like Uzumaki game, and I wanted to play it on here, but it's just kind of all text, and we're not good enough for reading no, Japanese. No, she's she not she not running. This is this. Start going really slow. Right, space is still fast forward if you need to do that. Could get in the hole. Like, I think Susan Man comes out of that hole in, in, in some random instances. I do not believe you can get through that hole. Okay, fine. Get in the hole. <laughs> how, do you feel, how do you feel so far about it, Derek? Not bad. I'm kind of, <laughs> I'm kind of bummed. Like, this isn't more. Oh, than someone's peeking. Yep. Let's do this. Let's do this. I, I need, I need him. Hey, the clock tower without the scissor man. All right. <laughs> scissor man. Tobin, I'm not gonna put this on stream, like they're not gonna see it, but I'm just gonna show Tobin this dumbass thing I made. And Tobin, do not describe it at all. Don't even read it out loud. They'll, they'll know. They'll know. They'll know. They'll know. You'll, you'll know soon enough, probably by the time this video goes up. <laughs> well, that was something that Derek had me do. Yep. How, <laughs> how long did you take to do that? How much of your life is devoted to that? Uh, like, well, three hours, maybe? Right. It didn't feel like it was that long. Yeah. I was expecting you to, 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 to be a while. Uh, you know, it, it oh, I got the spirit in me. <laughs> wait, wait, is she, is she running to the window? Is this... So we are, we are waiting to find out which, which of our friends is going to be murdered first, and that kind of sets us on our path. Um, and that's, I think, a random occurrence. I'm hoping it's Derek. <laughs> All the lights go out in Calvin's apartment. Uh oh, they come back on. They come back on, and dead. there's a hole in the ring. Okay, when I click on things, she doesn't seem to want to run. So I weird. Just... It's just gonna. Uh... <laughs> 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 well. Oh, all oh. done with that. Turn that off. That's how I. That's how I turn off the TV. Just deliberately slow walk. It's where that first line like goes away yeah. really quickly, and it, like fades away. I bet that makes it very difficult to read, or maybe this is just difficult to emulate. It's gonna get this box. Hmm, a box. Oh, no. <laughs> you're not even gonna look in the box. I don't too spoke to look in the box. <laughs> you think Scissor Man's in the box? Just look in the box! Alright, let's get out of here, because I'm pretty sure if we continue down this hall into the other foyer, uh, we will... See, Scissor Man. Uh, let's... Does this game have the creepy, like, kind of approaching audio of Scissor Man, or...? Uh, it should! <laughs> So I, mean, I think that's like one of the key features. Can you guys do a remix of this? Hell yeah. 
<laughs> There's the remix right there. Yeah. I now have phone records. Wow, 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 I'm, I'm the scissor man, I cut her! Oh, you're so tiny. I'm out of here. Uh, so, uh, SP Player wants to know, Hey Derek, when you first played through this game, I assume you mean the Super Nintendo version. Yeah. Um, how long did it take you? Did you ever consult a walkthrough? Yes, um... Uh, I will elaborate more on this in a future video. Ooh. But, this, this game takes place exclusively in this mansion. And this is a pretty good example of how the hallways look, even in, uh, uh, in, in the Super Nintendo version. It's really easy to, to sort of get lost and, and think like, where do I need to go? Oh, I'll go to that one room. And then sit there and go, well, where the fuck is that one room? And then spend 10, 15 minutes trying to find, uh, you know, that one room. He's just gonna open the door. He's just gonna open the door, the shower, Derek. Right? He's just gonna open the door. He's not an idiot, is he? What, he uses scissors to cut his the smart brains? Or just dumb brains? But I would still say this this game is, is you know, it's it's a point click adventure game. On a I mean I mean through and through. So did it work with the Super Nintendo mouse? No, but it but clock towers for the PlayStation 1 work with that mouse. That's crazy. This is a toilet. There you beat Clock Tower. No, that's the toilet's on the yes. left, that's a sink. So I could only get us ever as far as the castle. In Clock Tower for the PlayStation? Yeah. Well, you got damn near the end then. That's basically the, uh, the last And then section. I was just like in a loop. And I couldn't figure out how to advance from there. Yeah, I got stuck in this one area. And it's classic like, there's this table and then a thing on the table. Uh, and right. you, it's easy to think that uh, you have discovered everything in that room. Yeah, I just remember I was in a loop where like I could out, outrun them and like get them to fall out the fake door or the door that goes off the edge of a cliff yeah. repeatedly. But I couldn't. All right. Huh. Um, in that game, especially, uh, I felt like Scissor Man, at a point, will just stop trying, will stop coming out, because you are still waiting for the next thing to happen. He just gets bored. So he's like, well, he's like, I'm gonna take a break, you know. She hasn't gotten into the, the spooky chapel yet, or something right. like that, you know. But I always, I assume that's just like the, the video game, understanding, yo, this is a video game, and... If you were constantly trying to, uh, needing to evade, this is a man it would get kind of old. And also in the Super Nintendo one, I feel like this is a man is 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 less often just pro prowling around. Mm -hmm. He's usually lying in wait in a box or a locker somewhere. Yeah, because he's only the one on PlayStation. He he literally just kind of roamed the halls. Yeah, and and you'll be just minding your own business, and then like all of a sudden, like the music will yeah will fade in, and then clanging metal and you're like oh shit better hide in this box <laughs> and, and hope and hope that it works sometimes yeah. it doesn't you know Derek I have a question why don't you just leave alright <laughs> but her friend is dead she can't leave well there isn't there... fuck it leave yeah I think all video games should have the option have a fuck it button yeah and you get like a separate cutscene and everything and technically you beat the game you get an achievement <laughs> well Calvin and I uh, talked about this when we were playing through Clock Tower 2 I think it'd be funny if every like there's a series of these types of there's games. A, there's a franchise, and in every one, the canonical there, there, ending. No, is, yeah, the canonical ending was that you just left. <laughs> so it's always a guy who's like, nothing spooky's ever happened to me. Mm -hmm. Or like, I don't, I just, just I'm just like, I'm still alive to see another day because like I just <laughs> fucking got out, you know. He's just like, nope. And turns around <laughs> but then, and yeah, but then, but every time to play the interesting part of the game, he has to be like. Every other time I've ran away, but not this time. Yeah. I refuse. So look out for my new uh, series of twine games, uh, Scaredy Stan. <laughs> he's so scared, he runs away every no, time. No thanks, Ned. <laughs> <laughs> Spooky house, no thanks. No thanks. <laughs> you can use that, Calvin. I'm out of here, Harold. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, Sammy. <laughs> Run away, Randall. <laughs> Uh, this is, this get in that cabin, get out of here. <laughs> get in that car. Uh, That's a nice car. You have to find the keys somewhere, and then you have to sit there and click hot, it for a while. Hot wire it. Uh, yeah. 
Is how about that son of a bitch? I think that means a. Get in the car, girl. Let's do this. I'm getting in the car, just as slow as you can be. Did she move this slow in the Super Super Nintendo version? Mm, not quite. Nah. I guess I'm not driving this car. It's, I have to find the keys and I forget where they it's are. A, it's under the car. Is it? Are you, no. Are you serious? Well, how would I see a key with these graphics, Derek? I thought you was new, man. It's a video game. I'm, not, I'm dumb. I thought there was an option to just hide under the car for the rest of the game. <laughs> Sleep in the car. Yeah, that's the key box. Yeah. Just open the key box. No keys in here. Have you ever, like, ever seen a pair of keys behind the visor? You know, the, cla the classic movie Never. thing, like, our hero Never. is in the car. Wait. Oh. Huh? There's the keys. Never. But who would, do, who would do that? Yeah. Who would do that? A fool. Has that ever existed in, in real life, or has that just became a movie trope? I have a question. Who in their right mind, like, puts their house key, like, under their mat? Marty McFly. But... It's so the thing. It's so trope. Marty McFly. It's so cliche now. You can do it, because people think, like, it's, it's so... It's too obvious. It's too obvious. Now, my parents, what they did is, uh, they put a house key underneath the mat in the backyard up on the deck. <laughs> Because you gotta work for it. You'd think, yeah, no one's gonna like seriously like r somebody would notice. Our neighbor would notice. Like, okay, somebody is all up in their yard. All right, are we ready to move on from Clock Tower for the Wonder Swan? Right, now, yeah. Now wait. You wait for the Scissor Man, and then you moon salt from the top. <laughs> Do a frog splash. Yeah. Perfect landing. <laughs> Oops! I clicked outside the box. Oh no! I thought that was a weird sound for this game. Yeah. <laughs> I remember trouble. hearing this game was terrible. It looks like it is actually a functioning version of Clock Tower. Who fucking knew? And then he cuts you. Let's see what's in here. Oh, I think this is the kitchen. Should have like gross bugs in it. <laughs> Hell yeah! Oh. I, don't see, I don't see any gross bugs. Hold seen... on. Run over here, quick. Girl. <laughs> Jessica, please. Baby. Honey. You right. should run over and then actually activate it. Yeah, I guess once I if have... You're, if you're doing the speed if run... I... <laughs> if you were speed running the Wonder Swan version of Clock Tower, like a cool dude... Add that bugs! Did I say bugs? <laughs> Pogo sticks in there. <laughs> There's two bugs! Oh! Which, what what am I looking? What am I looking at? Calvin. Oh. Calvin, it's Bray Wyatt. <laughs> what am I? What am I, Derek? What am I looking at right now? It's like an ink blot test. Did the game just freeze? I don't know. No. Okay. Ah, ah, bugs. bugs. <laughs> Let's get, get, out. Get, get out of here. You're gonna get covered in bugs. I'm gonna run. <laughs> Come on, Come on, girl. <laughs> Like, All these spooky bugs. <laughs> Not the light switch, you dummy. Turn bugs, off. Bugs, bugs are <laughs> bugs. bugs. Get confused by the dark. <laughs> now they can see better than oh, ever. Wait. Thanks a lot, Toby. <laughs> Looks like your character needs to take a shower, Derek. <laughs> Just like the real Derek. All right, I'm. I'm. I'm this game. It, this is actually Pigpen's sister from <laughs> from Peanuts. This is her origin story. Well, well, that's a game. I still can't believe this exists, and I'm I'm shocked that this seems passable. All right, let me play a video game. Calvo's turn. When does Tobin get some? Well, well he, um, he he brought. He's the only wanted me to play Resident Evil. Oh, okay. You what? You spent your turn. Yeah. All I, right. So uh, let's sacrifice my turn. Let's play a spooky game. Was that a magic reference? I a sacrifice a turn. I haven't. I've never played Magic. You're some kind of nerd. I might play tabletop games a little bit. Oh yeah, we were we were playing. All right, so this is it moves. What? I've uh, never played it before. What is it? It's a spooky game. So you heard? I want to have heard of this before. Let me update. It moves. It moves. It might not even be in. Uh, no, it is Giant not. Bombs database. Bedtime. Hey, bedtime. Bedtime is supposed to be a happy event for a tired child. 
For me, it was terrifying. While well, some children might complain about being put to bed before they have finished watching a film or playing their favorite video game. Mom. When I was a child, nighttime was something to truly fear. Somewhere in the back of my mind, it still is. This oh. is me. Oh. oh. Hey. Hey, guys. What's this poster? Poster from a movie. I got it from my brother. Thanks, brother. Full of toys and stuff. Look at that little lamp on the floor. That's cute. Oh. I think that little picture just says a wolf. It's a wolf. <laughs> it's a bunk bed. I sleep on the, in the top. Where's your brother? A table. I, I don't get a chair. Oh, it's a chair, dummy. Come on. I cannot prove that what happened to me was objectively real. But I can swear that what I experienced was genuine horror. A fear which in my life, I'm glad to say, has never been equaled. I will relate it to you all now as best I can. Make of it what you will. But I'll be glad to just get it off my chest. Oh! <laughs> I'm going back to bed. Who's that? What's that person? Flowers. Mom put these here. Is that, is that dad this or is that brother? This is my father. Pfft, Dad! Don't go pulling out too much stuff now. It's bedtime soon. Right, let's see what's uh, over here. This is my brother's room. He told me yesterday to keep out of that room until we both keep out of the room we had both shared until then. All right. Can't go back there. Can't remember exactly when it started, but my apprehension towards falling asleep seemed to correspond with my being moved into a room of my own. Hey, Mom. This is my mother. How do you like your new room? Soon you'll be sleepy alone for the first time. This is gonna go great. You got Colonel O'Brien over there by your closet. A man with a mustache. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just a bunch of clothes in here. No video games. Boxes full of stuff. Ventilation. I think Mom said this is... Yeah, it looks like you know one of the window here. Uh, it looks really stuffy. Mom told me not to touch your stuff, especially this stuff. Special stuff. Yeah, that, that's, that's mom's private stuff. Nothing too interesting. It's her weed. Mom smokes weed. I was eight years old at the time. And until then, I had shared a room quite happily with my older brother. As is perfectly understandable for a boy five years my senior, my brother eventually wished for a room of his own. And, and as a result, I was given the room at the back of the house. As my brother was given a new bed, I was given the bunk beds which we used to share. I was upset about sleeping on my own. I was excited at the thought of being able to sleep in the top bunk. Top bunk. Which seemed far more adventurous to me. You know, for a long time, I, I had bunk beds as a kid. Even uh, though I had bunk beds with my brother. I didn't have a brother, though. Uh, my, my mom went very far in the process of, of adopting uh, another kid. But, like, right at the end, something happened where it didn't work out. Like, far enough that she bought bunk beds. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah. All right, it's bedtime. Bedtime. Already? Yes, adults need this. their sleep, you see. You'll be sleeping alone for the first time. You excited? Yes, Mom. <laughs> I never liked the bottom bunk. Uh, I would go to, like, my aunt's place, and she had a bunk bed for us to sleep in. I was always worried that the bed was going to collapse and crush me. I can wiggle in the bed. All right, I'm turning off the lights. Good night. Like, don't want to be on the bottom bunk. If it's an earthquake, I won't, I won't die if I'm on the top oh, wiggle, bunk. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Wiggle, 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 no. wiggle, 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 Just keep with the LMFAO references up in here. <laughs> oh, no! Cave. Cave. Chapter 1, Cave. Cave. I slept on the top bunk for a while, and one time I rolled out of my bed into all the floor. I think I did that once, too. Woke up pretty quick. Uh, yeah, let's save. Sorry. I, 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 my dad made a bunk bed, but he, he, I just had an elevated bed, and he put my dresser on the bottom. Okay, yeah. What's this guy? What's his deal? I don't know. He's just hanging out. Is he on top of a small water hole? The water is dirty. Probably not a good idea to drink it. Don't drink that. I don't know he's just talk. watching you. Is he like yeah, way up on a tree? Uh, yeah, I think he's like on a tree that's over here. So I don't think I can actually talk to him. There's little bugs flying around. All right. There's bugs. Nothing wrong with bugs. Oh, you're a bug. There's a monkey up there. Kind of a little flashy. Weird plant. Uh, it's a skull door. Yep, sure. Of course it is. A pot and some ragged cloth. I wonder what's cooking. Hey, good looking. What you at cooking? 
Oh yeah, sure. Oh, that painting's moving. Stalking is such a strong word. I prefer to think of it more as intense research of one individual. It's a big head. By the way, your missing sock is under your bed. With me. Just kidding. Dude, that is not... A cold, unwelcoming breeze comes from the bottom of the stairs. Uh, Calvin, that's not, that's not a picture, that's a window. Just go down. Beep, boop. That sound effect <laughs> was amazing, though. The... Oh. Weird mushroom. It's poisonous. Eat it. Oh. They took control away for a second for some sparkling. Thought... Huh. Yeah, I'm not liking those sounds. Weird mushroom looks poisonous. It's just a big hole. Fuck, remember Space Funeral? That was rad. God, that was good. A purple mushroom, definitely poisonous. Oh. Well, what's that? It's fine. Could be. There's red liquid seeping from the mushroom hat. Mushroom hat. I doff my mushroom hat to m'lady. M'lady. M m mushroom. Mushroom? Mushroom. Hey guys, you remember Badger Badger? Mushroom. Mushroom. Oh man. <laughs> remember these memes? So, I'm so sorry. Oh, oh shit. What was that? That was a weird face thing. Uh, oh. Yeah. Alright. Dan Cook, super fingers on. Oh man, we got we got a puzzle, guys. I'm not sure what the rules of this puzzle is. What? Oh well, I solved it. You did it. You Whee! did it. You're genius. It was the best. Yep, red liquid, red liquid mushroom hat. Well, that's not a good sound. You made me turn around. Just keep going. Right. Never investigate the creepy sounds. Alright. Don't investigate how dumb you are. My answer is very. Pretty dumb. <laughs> hey. No big deal? So this was made with, like, anime maker, RPG. Uh, yeah, R RPG R maker. RPG I stunner. Think. RPG stunner? Oh my god, RPG stunner! Uh oh. I'm walking real slow now. It's shaking. Oh no. RPG Center out of nowhere. <laughs> That's what RKO stands for, is is RPG. Uh, you go faster, go. I, I can't go you faster. Go a lot go faster. faster. I can't. That's the thing. Yeah. John Harper is the thing. Coming to get you. He's gonna eat. No. Oh. You're fine. You're fine. No, I fell in the hole. Thanks a lot. Spider. Spider face. Then I got a game over. Why uh, are people getting enough audio in the chat here? Because this game is getting is really really. I just want to make sure they're hearing it. Yeah, let me turn that up a little bit. Because I think that's Moom. that's where a lot of the spooks are coming. Moom, here I had a bad dream. Moom. All right, that's her name, Mom, not Moom. Moom. Post for a movie, got it from my brother. Oh, I didn't look at my teddy bear. It's Mr. Teddy, bear. teddy. Have I ever told the stream about uh uh? Oh, I, 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 baby, baby Fluffy. I blanked on his name, which is the worst. Baby Fluffy. My my, my stuffed dog, Baby Fluffy. Mom, I had a bad dream. That's wrong. You're still Sweet. having a bad dream. What's wrong? I had reoccurring dreams for a while where in the dream I would wake up from having a bad dream. I would run to my mom's room and then I'd go into her room and realize that she was not my mother. That she was a monster. This is not my house. I had a bad dream. No, that's too bad, sweetie. I'll be up in a minute. We can eat breakfast together. All right, hurry up. Go change your clothes, and I'll be right there. What's Dad doing? Sleepy, leave me alone. He's just... He's bringing home bacon, all right? Jeez. <laughs> no need to go here right now. Is that the bathroom? Stupid bro. It's locked, stupid bro. Let's get dressed. Bro, bro, bro. Pop, pop, pop. Upgrade. And so another day started. It was a day of little importance to our story. Scoop! Won't bo bother you with details. The one thing I remember is that even though I played with friends like I always did, I somehow still felt lonely. I didn't enter my new room until later that night. It was time to go to sleep again. Where am I supposed to go? I don't, I don't get it. Mommy told me to go straight to bed. Ooh. 
Are we dreaming right now? Wiggle, 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 wiggle. I mean, it seems like... What are the odds they would stream a Wonder Swan game? A Wonder Swan game? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Maybe the stream... If I wiggle enough... Is a dream. I won't go to sleep. <laughs> That's now. how I fight off. Falling asleep. <laughs> never know where to put the Y in Labyrinth. That does not look right. Labyrinth. Yeah. Uh, sure. Yeah, Labyrinth is one of those words I never never spell right the first time. Half the time I get calendar wrong, get the A's and the E's mixed up. I, o I always spell definitely wrong. Okay. Oh. Yeah, definitely is one of those words I just, through brute force and writing it a lot, figured it out. And then now I know how to spell it. Yeah, I think I... I... That one's got a smiley face. Good on definitely. This is a sequence thing. Cause well, that's a smiley. Turn off. That's a smiley. That's a frowny. Okay, let's try. Bam. 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 And then. Yeah. Woo! Solving puzzles like a motherfucker. Got the shit locked down like a bear hug. Some kind of machinery. Wanted. Your soul. Want a poster. Alright. What was that one game, like, You May Marry or something like that, that was uh, uh, all yeah, uh, yeah, You May Nikki. You May Nikki, yeah. A poster for some concert. It looks old. It says poop. Oh, little cover. Oh! So, All right. So this is one of those games, huh? Cool. Neat. And that's just going to stay there for a while. I like the staying there. Yeah. I like that. And not just like a boo and oh, it's no. gone. Is it going to do it again? No, but I think your screen, the red tint just got a little... Oh, what was that? No, it's fine. Hey, buddy. Yeah, it's fine. You should stand in that corner and wait for him to pop out and talk to you. Can you not move when he's... No, I can move when he just disappears. Ventilation, maybe... This is a labyrinth. Now, if this smiling dude would blink, that would be even... That'd be like, pretty good. Yeah. Sure, you know how to use a fire extinguisher. Good to know. Sometimes you need to use a fire extinguisher. Alright, uh, I, get on this I don't know screen? if the, the creepy dude's face is really coming across in the screen. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, and a corp. What's that? What's the deal? What's the deal with Anacorp? Who are these corporations? Oh, there's another one. I got three so far. You running a lot faster now? Oh shit, I am. Whee! Some yakky sacks going. Don't go. Yeah, he's sack. Don't roll back. Wait, yakity sack? Is that what the. the uh, uh, what is that one guy who chases women I'll, thing? Always the, mix up. It's Benny Hill, right? Yeah, Benny yeah. Hill, yeah. yes. Always, always end up saying Benny Hinn, who is a televangelist. Oh, I remember Benny Hinn. Yeah. Is he the one who would, like, touch people and, and, like, they would, uh, they'd fall over? Yeah, yeah, the character, was that, charismatic? There's poop. Yep, I, see, I see it. I can go. Well, yeah, it was, like, a TV faith healer. And, and it wasn't just, like, you know, praying and laying hands. He'd, That's like, he'd, like, get really cool. dramatic and, like, have, take his jacket off and be, like, be healed. And then, like, the person would fall over and walk once I got back up. I don't think the next one appears in, until you've gotten the last one. Like, I don't think they're necessarily all here at the same time. I feel like I was running it before. That face kind of looks like... I can't remember. I haven't seen the movie, but I've seen a couple screens from it. Uh, came out a few years ago with, like, Patrick Wilson, maybe? Mm -hmm. uh, it was one of those... Oh, there we go. The Conjuring? So that's yeah. Five. And that like, was a pretty big hit. And there's, like, the creepy monsters that show up at some point with dumb faces. Come on. I don't watch a lot of horror movies. No, so, I, you know. I, uh, and I, and I have no interest in, like, superstition, uh, uh kind of, uh, haunting Six. films. Oh. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hey. 
I was just saying I like the fact that there was a jump scare, but then the jump yeah, stuck then, around. Yeah, and then like held on it. Yeah. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Uh, when you awaken from a deep sleep to something moving or stirring, it can take a few moments for you to truly understand what is happening. The fog of sleep hangs over your eyes and ears even when lucid. Something was moving. There was no doubt about that. At first I wasn't sure what it was. Everything was dark, almost pitch black, but there was enough light creeping in from outside to outline the room. Two thoughts appeared in my mind almost simultaneously. The first was that my parents were in bed because the rest of the house lay both in darkness and silence. The second thought turned t turned to the noise, a noise which had obviously awoken me. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. That was it. Bedsheets rustling in the dark and something, someone breathing. As if some disturbed sleeper was attempting to get all too comfortable in the bottom bunk. Don't get too comfortable, loser. I lay there in disbelief, thinking that the noise was either my imagination or perhaps just my pet cat finding somewhere comfortable to spend the night. It was then that I noticed that my door shut as it had been uh, shut as it had been since I'd fallen asleep. Perhaps my mom had checked in on me and the cat had sneaked into my room then. Yes, that must be it. I turned to face the wall, closing my eyes in vain, to hope I could fall back asleep. As I moved, the rustling noise from underneath me ceased. I thought that I must have disturbed my cat. But I quickly realized that the visitor in the bottom bunk was was very much less mundane than my pet trying to sleep and much more sinister. Ooh. If I had any criticism of this game, it's kind of wordy. You could cut all these sentences in half. As if alerted to and disgruntled by my presence, the disturbed sleeper began to toss and turn violently like a child having a tantrum in their bed. Also, being very direct with the language. Yeah. Could, if you were a little more vague with yeah. it and maybe po poetic. I could hear the sheets twist and turn with increasing ferocity. Uh, fear that gripped me, not like the subtle sense of unease I had experienced earlier, but now po potent and terrifying. Hamana, hamana, hamana. Heart raced as my eyes panicked, scanning the almost impenetrable darkness. I let out a cry. Her. As most young boys do. I instinctively <laughs> shouted on my mother. Mother! <laughs> I hear something so. Well, as I began to breathe a sigh of relief that my parents were coming to save me, the bug bed suddenly started to shake violently as if gripped by an earthquake, scraping against the wall. Mother! 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 I tell you, Dean, it's not to sleep in my bunk. <laughs> I could hear the sheets below me thrashing around as if tormented by malice. I did not want to jump down to safety as I feared the thing in the bottom bunk would reach out and grab me. Pulling me into the darkness so I stayed there, white knuckles clenching on my own blanket like a shroud of protection. Mother! <laughs> Mother! The way it seemed like an eternity. What's wrong? Did you have a bad dream? I cried and my mother consoled me. Tears of fear followed by relief streamed down my face. Yet, through all of the horror and relief, I did not tell her why I was so upset. Oh. I cannot explain it, but it was as though whatever had been in that bunk would return, if I, if I even so much as spoke of it. Whether that was the truth, I did not know. But as a child, I felt that if unseen menace remained close, listening, my mother lay in the empty bunk, promised to stay there until morning. I remember the next day waiting to go any wanting to go anywhere, be anywhere but in that suffocating room. It was a Saturday. Oh. Played outside quite happily with my friends. Oh. Although our house was not large, we were lucky to have a long sloping garden in the back. Privilege. We played there often, as much of it was overgrown, and we could hide in the bushes. Climb in that huge sycamore tree which towered above all else and easily imagine ourselves in the throes of a grand adventure. As fun as it all was, occasionally my eye would turn to that small window in my room. Ordinary, slight, and innocuous. But for me, that thin boundary was a looking glass into a strange, cold pocket of dread! Outside, the lush green surroundings of our garden filled me with, filled with the smiling faces of my friends. Inside, the feeling of something in that room watching me play, waiting for the night when I would be alone, eagerly filled with hate. Kind of, kind of getting cold on this game. It may sound strange to you, but by the time my parents ushered me back into that room for the night, I said nothing. I didn't protest. I didn't even make an excuse as to why I couldn't sleep there. I still felt this thing would be enraged if I so much as spoke of it. Another night came. Yeah, let's get, let's get going. Let's move this along. How many nights are there? Thirty nights. Five nights. Five nights, Freddy. Chapter three, factor highest. All right, let's just peek. Let's save and then just peek around a little bit at this next part and then let's call it. 
Oh man. Whoa. Okay, no, we gotta stick around. Yeah, we gotta explore a little bit. All right, now we're now I'm interested. Now we're playing Doom. Oh, I found the run button. Whee! Yeah. Nice. Uh. No, just keep going. Yeah, just. You don't want a huge skull. There. A huge skull. Don't say that about skulls glowing. I banner a long pole. It's too old to, and torn to make any details. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh. Uh. A huge skull. Still huge. Still a skull. Oh. Told you to keep running, Calvin. You stopped. I d it made me stop. Game tricked me. Play with the champ. Alright. No big deal. Some kind of altar. Alright, this seems like another maze. And I'm not sure if I'm down with that. All right, Derek, are you ready to get spooked? Uh, I'm actually kind of. Did I, I'm I'm back in again on all this. Right, all right, let's I don't look know. Let's I'm the ground more. It's Derek. It's some kind of machine. A machine for pigs? <laughs> no, it's a scarier game. I don't know. I haven't played. I, I, I haven't played machine for pigs. Some kind of machine. All these. Yolo. All these Yolo. <laughs> what? Why did you just say Yolo? I said Yolo on the floor. No, I said hello. I flipped the switch. We played Amnesia briefly on a stream. I, I was and you were not impressed. I was not feeling it. But we no. haven't played Machine for Pigs. I've heard that game is less scary and just like just thoroughly depressing with its yeah. story. Yeah. The Amnesia playthrough was that the one where we just got like stuck in that one area for like twenty minutes and then quit. I don't know. Almost the entire experience was just doing nothing for me. We played for like two hours. We didn't even see a we didn't even see a monster. Yeah, but we were also told by like multiple people that. We got really lucky for some reason. Uh, that like normally a monster shows up much more often than that. I do remember like at, at the end we were like, fuck it, let's just sit here and wait for a monster and like no one ever Yeah. And then it was like we wandered around for a while and was like, no, you didn't look at this bookshelf long enough to see oh, there was a switch. Wait, did it there. say hello before? Hello. Hmm. That's why I said yellow, because it looked like yellow for half a oh, second. Okay. You look like YOLO. I will yeah. only live once. This is true. Oh, no, don't worry about it. There's a dude oh, there. Right. Uh, it's a the French. Switch. Are you? Are you ready to rumble? Do 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 do. I'm guessing all those switches. Yeah. Will remove a door. We somebody's got to run around and find out which door got removed. Hey, oh, buddy. And there's paper, paper, paper bag man. Bagman. Hey, bagman. Whatever, he's got a paper bag on his head. No, 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 that. You're probably, you're probably beautiful. Probably beautiful. Just take, take off that, take off that. Take, take off that bag, girl. Beautiful, just the way you are. You're beautiful. No you're matter You're beautiful. It's true. Hey, there's a head poking out. Hey, buddy. A creepy mask. Yeah. Whew. Damn. There's the creepy mask. Oh, he's oh, smiling. It's, oh, it's smiling at me. Don't like that. Hi. Hello. <laughs> you got a little bit of distortion at the end. Now the mask is gone? Yeah. Yep. Alright, let's go back to where the dude... Oh, oh, no. There it is. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Oh, Don't uh, load. Don't load. Okay, so it's just there now. Yeah, and I do with that. All so right. you mask, step on you. Stupid mask, step on a stupid mask. Look at me. Do I look like I gotta give a what? Oh nope, still shut. I feel like you don't want to open that one because there's clearly another dude on on the other side well, of it. Let the bag man out. Where's the open one? Uh, there's one on the upper right hand corner, but that one's open now. That one's already You've open. already flipped that one. But there was a, a switch in the upper right hand corner. But didn't I flip the switch by the mask? Yeah, you did, but that was in the kind of the mid right hand seat. This is that that this is new now. Okay. <laughs> nice. Well. You should well. probably hurry up before you drown. <laughs> what are you gonna do? There's red liquid pouring out. I'm sure this. Well, there's probably like 
drains and stuff. Uh, all right. Nope, still not open. That doesn't really look like it. Bagman. Still closed. So, no, there's to the left of him, there's doors. Yep, right here. Ha! Oh. Nice! It's a pile of bloody skulls. Can't even look at it. Y yeah, I can. It's right there. Uh. Oh, that's not an okay sound. Alright. I've angered blood, blood, blood skulls. Alright. This one's new, right? More lights. I might only leave Bagman. Yeah. Yep. Great. Who let the Bagman out? You. One of you jerks let out the bag man. Just crack that altar. Oh, Ooh. oh, hey, uh, uh, oof, hey, hey, uh, I'm a... thanks a lot, Derek. Now I got sucked up into the hell dimension. Yeah, but Fine. you escaped the bag man. You know, it's funny how certain words can remain hidden <laughs> from your mind no matter how blatant or obvious they are. All right, I'm done with this game. That's that this scenes this this is a game of peaks and valleys. Yep. All right, Derek. It's time. It's time to see what's up with this game. Uh, I think me and you are gonna trade seats. Uh, sure. Here, let me uh, update uh, what we're playing. Cause I want you to have full mouse and keyboard control. There we go. Tone got so, got so scared he had to go piss. He had to just get it out of the system. Warning! The game contains flashing lights. Uh, let me see if that shows up. Yeah, we're gonna see what's up with this uh, Five Nights at Freddy's thing. Let's see, we're still in the transition here. Yeah, it should I don't be think it's, it's should be, showing should be, up. should be showing up. There we go. Yeah, there we go. All right. Sit down. Probably from that, that thing. Yes. I would almost prefer to have it. That should be all working. All right. Now let's see what's up with this Five Nights at Freddy's business. Well, let's wait, wait till Tobin comes back. Yeah. Do I need to use the keyboard at all? I'm not sure. Uh, I gave it to you just in case. Yeah. All right. Oh, man. So... Another fucking live stream of people playing this game. Yeah. Tell me, you ready to get spooked? I, I had to go to the bathroom. That's how spread <laughs> I just get spooked I was. I kind of have to go to the bathroom too, but I'm just going to... Had to empty it out. Man, man I, I, I kind of like this... I'm not used to this angle. Like, yeah. It's so <laughs> weird. Never, this ain't so bad. Um, so, Five Nights at Freddo's. This is, yep. This is basically like, what if Chuck E. Cheese was creepier, and then you stayed there overnight? It's just like, jump scared the video game. Family Pizza, we're looking for a security guard to work the night shift. Have you seen the trailer for the second game yet? Yeah. That looks really... How they made the duck sexy? <laughs> no, they, they made it what? so there are doors. You have to wear a costume. You have to put a costume um, on and, like, I guess, stare at, at the guys um, as they... Give me the TV remote. I want to turn this up a little bit for us here. Oh, okay. Hello? Oh. Oh. Telephone. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, we already got him. <laughs> Phone's ringing, dude. Do I, have you, to, do I have to pick it up? Probably. Hello? Oh. Hello? Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact. So, I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So, let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. So, you don't have to click this. You just gotta roll over thing, that. You know. But that uh, does use power. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. 
as for entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will uh, Super Child 88 says, what is a snack trap? Basically, <laughs> actually. The total that, that is legit. What's like not is creepy now, night trap. Or creepy in a better way. To worry about. Night, night uh, trap wasn't the creepy. It was just dumb. I guess it had that sort of weird, no, like, spying on girls. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm talking about. Those same stupid songs for 20 years. I never got a bath. I'd probably be a bit irritable at night, too. So remember... I've seen enough people play this game to know that, like, you know the mechanics. I think I do, but I do. I think like night three is kind of where this game really takes off. Yeah. Where the characters do tend to wander a bit. They're left in some kind of free roam. Kev keeps playing. Says, "Oh no, you guys messed up. I won't spoil, but good luck." Oh, was I supposed to mute the call? No. Yeah. Or we mess up in the last game. No, he's just saying like this is a this is a messed up no. game. Uh, now, Good luck. So is the premise that like the only real they're like free roaming the animatronics, so that they're actually. So yeah, he's explaining some of this, but the premise is that like at yeah, nighttime, it's the dumbest hours. premise because you would just quit yeah, this job. Uh, the premise is like at nighttime they just wander the halls, and if they see anything that's not a robot, they'll try and stuff you in a suit and kill you. They'll probably try to... That, whatever that like, thing it's is. a super contrived premise. Right. But, yo, um, video games are awesome. Now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't... Oh, I guess the dude will keep talking until 2 a.m. game time. Uh, I mean, that, I don't think that means that they won't move at giving this time, though. Oh. Thanks for the chat lied to us again. Can you just stay in this room the whole game? You can't leave this room. Oh. P people talk about Calvin keeps changing the same can. There it's playing. Calvin's look at this. I mean, they're not moving, and this guy doesn't show up till the second story, or the second night. So I'm just keeping an eye on these three, right? Yeah. There's three hoppies. There's, yeah. there's, there's there's three. Just like in the poster. And the fourth one here. Uh, nope. Someone said dubba dubba dubba. Just loves that dubstep. You don't even need to use light yet, because they'll, they'll move slower than that. Yeah. There's still three of them. What a cool, what a cool noise that was. I love, my favorite thing is that her bib says, let's eat. <laughs> I think I think that, that just, just perfect. Yeah. You know, I, you know, I love, you know, childish things can be very scary with... Yeah. Uh, the prism of like you know horror, and I think just let's eat is so. Man, I can we talk about that red thing with the candle on it? Oh, the, the red skull. Yeah. So that's super disconcerting. I mean, it's just these three, right? There's no one else I need to worry about, right? So. You've, and you've made it to 3 a.m. You got more than 50 percent oh, power left. Oh, someone move. Uh oh. Uh, so check check one B. Move. Oh, shit! Where'd he go? Uh, fuck, where is he? Hey, dude. Oh, there he is. What up, buddy? How are you doing? How you doing? So, so I mean, I can't, I can't just stay on him because I don't yeah. drain my batteries. Yeah. But like, yeah, so that, um, that green thing in the lower left, that's your power right. usage. You are always using, uh, um, a little bit. You're always using one bar. Um, but then, like, t shutting the door and turning the lights on, that uses more bars. <laughs> so, like, obviously, like, the map shows where you are. So, so how, can they get to your room, then? Yes. Like, yeah, that's, the, that's, that's game over, is if they get to the room. But you can't do anything to... What's going on, buddy? <laughs> How you doing? Um, you can shut... If, if you see them right outside your window, you can shut the door on them, and they'll leave. Okay. The difference is this guy will... Make a break for you. Yeah, perp uh, or the the red fox guy will. Yeah. So I go like bop, and if I saw him in the window, I would LARP. Why can't you just leave the door closed all the time? Because it uses all your power. Yeah. All right. And when you run out of power, everything opens up and you're dead. All right. Is, then, is it just a fail state? Like straight up fail state, or can you? Um, if oh. it, it it takes a certain amount of. <laughs> that was just like looking right at the camera. Girl. It uh, it takes a certain amount of time after. Uh, 
after the power goes out for them to get you. So if, if you make it to 6 a.m. before they get you if the, with the power's out, you'll still win. Oh, man. Uh, where are you? Uh, check the lights, yeah. Check your lights. You got two hours left. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, what up, girl? You guys pretty close. Right. You're there. All right, are you back there? All right, we, we got everyone. So yeah, Duck's gonna come up on the right there, I think. She's hanging out there. Yeah, this is some good shit. I'm already. Feeling it? You feeling it? Yeah. Any Listen, I, I wasn't playing. Oh, this, shit, shit. Where, where'd you go? I wasn't playing this game to be like. Okay. It ain't scary. Like, no, this is probably a very good at what it's trying to do. I could. I would not be nice. playing this game alone. Yeah, you're, you're, you're an hour left. And they are. They're both kind of. Got her. Oh, we're pretty good. I got him. Okay. All right. That guy. Down there. Okay, you were still just hanging out here. You're, we're almost to the end here. <laughs> Shit, duck's gone. You're still there. Okay, <laughs> Alright. <laughs> let's eat. Oh, man. Yeah, let's eat. That's my favorite <laughs> thing about this game. Is that her bibs just let's eat? Oh, gotta be close to six, right? Where did he go? Is he there? Uh, no, he's not there. He's there. <laughs> he's there. He's there. Hey, the supply closet. All right. Oh shit! Oh shit! You gotta check your lights. <laughs> Fuck! Ah! Close the door. I think you can open the door again. I would. Uh, <laughs> All right, maybe not. Is that a shadow right there? Yeah, it is. Shit. Fuck. You gotta be close to six. Alright. Oh, day yeah. one. The, the chat is indicating that you are using way too much power. Alright. Am I being too paranoid? Yeah. Okay. Don't worry, I'm sure the game's gonna punish me for that yeah, yeah. <laughs> soon enough. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so like, do you wait till you hear noises? Do you think? And then and then check the cameras? I think you, if, if you really wanted to, you could just stay back and forth and, and just check the lights. The thing that prevents you from doing that is this guy. Yeah. You have to kind of keep a camera on him or he will get you. Because he's he's quick. Is yes. That, the quick one? He runs down to the left here. That's not right. How's it like, like turning up the light right away? Oh, man. Uh, Diajado says, second night, you are going to die. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's me, Action Bronson voice. It's me. Alright. One's missing already. Great. Hey, yeah, buddy. Hanging out. Hanging out. Yep, Kevin, uh, Ken Kevin Stryker says, don't listen to the phone call, go right to work. Why would you uh, listen to the phone call? I, I think the phone call is all just like, so many other people died doing this job. Okay. Shit, shit. Kind of extraneous. You should just turn it off when, it's, when it goes black until you're ready to look again. <laughs> Because you're just wasting power looking at nothing. Probably right, but you're a jerk. <laughs> Try to Shut up. I don't want you to die, Derek. Gotcha. There's one, there's two, there's three. Okay. Count to three. <laughs> right. Oh, I saw Where was she? She was there. Yeah. Yeah. It's not even two o'clock, and I've yeah. spent twenty percent of my. Yeah, it feels like you should, um, 
Where is everyone? Okay, I've lost track of purple guy. There he is. Okay. She's still That's a good she's one. moved. Hey, what's oh. going on? What's yeah, so you? she she's coming down that hall, you should get out and that long dark hallway is real good. We yeah, there's like a, tell there's a blind there. spot, so like I think this camera can see stuff that this light doesn't illuminate. Mm -hmm. So the camera's actually kind of like yeah. over here down the hall a bit. Yeah, everyone's saying you're looking at the camera too much. Hey, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. You should just check it with a light before you actually shut it or open it. There you are, he's gone. And do, do they, are they gone for good? No. They're just wandering They're just wandering around. So like, he could just come back on, in like a minute. Oh, it is just now 2 a.m. Shit. Yeah. Oh, man. Uh. <laughs> that first hour was long. Yep. Well, right. it's like last time you were listening to the message, most of it. Like, what is, is it faster to look at the camera? No, because like, when you're looking at the camera, it's constantly draining it too. The light is just two for a second if we turn it off again. Like, I feel like now you should just sit here for a little bit. In, unless you hear a noise or something. No, does the game operate like that? I, actually... I don't know. I, I'm not sure. I'm, this is, these are just my theories. Like, you should, you should just be sitting here, kind of chill for a little bit, and then and then start looking at the camera again after a little bit. Because there are actual audio cues of, like, pitter-patter footsteps. Yeah. Alright, that was Tobin's chair. Or Mike's shitty chair. Alright. It's the problem with this new mic setup is we can't put spooky noises directly into each other's ears. Oh, uh, where's the duck? Where's the fucking. Alright, there's the duck. Alright, what's up? Where's the duck? Alright. Alright. We're all good. Everything's fine. So, how do these creatures operate? They're robots. Robots so they're are not magical. All right, you know, um, you know Charles Cheese. Yep. He's like right. that, so he can walk around. He's not attached to the stage. Okay. But like, I mean, they're not sentient. No, they're robots. But so like, they just detect inorganic or they, organic they, matter. They, like, well, that's not they're right. like, oh, what's? Oh, this is a robot, but he's not in his suit. Let's just. All right. All right. Three a.m. Fifty percent. You're you're, I'm, you're all right. I'm you're all right. Back to doing kind of all good. You're back to uh, the baseline of doing. All yeah, right. I don't know that I could. Last long with the windows, uh, the doors closed though. Yeah, because the doors use quite a bit of power, right? Guys, in the chat, <laughs> we've got the one and only Foxy the Pirate Co. Fox Ooh. joining us. Hello. Our... And she insists that she's not a furry. Oh, okay. <laughs> What's up? Hey, Duck. We got Ducky, and we got, oh, where'd you go? Duck Bear Bunny. Oh, uh, where the fuck's the bunny? Uh, you should. Yeah. Oh, damn. I knew it was gonna happen yeah. too. Yeah. I knew it was gonna happen. Checking those cameras too much, Derek. Oh, there we go. There it is. Let's see. That was good. Out. That didn't totally make me jump. Yeah. But that got me. That hit me right here. All right. One more, I want to do that one more time. Yeah. You want to try again? And then uh, do, do we want to kind of do a roulette thing, or is it just? <laughs> I ain't gonna, playing, I'm playing this shit. Just gonna be Derek. I ain't playing. playing this shit. <laughs> You're the one who made me buy this shit, so you can play it. Let's continue second night. Just people in the chat yelling, fuck. <laughs> That's nice and simple. I like it. Derek, you're on the clock. We're just like, wah, wah. Yep. Wah. No phone. Okay. Yeah, you've heard it. Duck's already, okay. Oh, oh you're hey, here hey, now. Word. When did you show up? Word, huh? So do I need to keep the camera on him or not look at him? I, I think when you leave the camera, it should be left on him. Okay. And then, because, like, as soon as he moves, like, you gotta close that door. He's the only one with, like, animation. You can yeah, actually see him. Yeah, the rest is, like, still. Yeah, I don't think they actually animate until they get here and then, like, they, their mouths go... Uh, according to Foxy the Pirate Co. Fox in, in the chat, it is she. I, my mistake. I know at least the, uh, the, the uh, let's eat is a shit. Yeah, the ducky. I don't like that noise. Oh, kind of slipping on that. I don't 
see nobody near me. Alright, I'm Alright, there you are, and there you are, and there you are. Foxy is saying it's he. Let's, let's just go with they for everyone. Whatever, yeah. Yeah, let's just keep it safe here. Dude shorthand for friends, so all these dudes. All these duders. Yeah, they're I all mean, buddies. They're robots all duders. are genderless. Uh, they're unless they're programmed with gender. See, at the last time, I'm like, I'm not seeing nobody. Go right back to the main area. And there you are. Is that the bird? Oh, I did not keep it on this guy. Big purple. Yo, hey girl, what up? Hey duck. So who? That's not. This is duck. There's purple. <laughs> duck. There's... Duck. Purple. Fox. Bear. <laughs> oh, I guess the purple's a bunny. Yeah. The ears. Handy ears to identify by. Oh. Good to know yeah. the sound. Yeah. Sound is relevant. Still there. Is he? Yeah. Yeah, it's just... No, okay. he's, he's still there. Derek, I can confirm. He's still there. Don't trust us? We have a de developing story, but uh, we believe he's, he's still there. Oh, you're using so much power right now. Oh, the door's still closed. Yeah. You're right. Oh. Ah! Well, shit. We <laughs> got there. Right, Fuck you just... then, jerk. <laughs> She just... <laughs> uh, Come on in, guys. <laughs> I'm leaving. Come on, face me, man. Got some, oh, you're, got some candy. You're at 54%. Alright. No. No, no, you're fucked. You're fucked. Shut the door. And it's just that side? <laughs> yep, you did, did they're shut, you're fine. Yeah. Check the light. He should be a hit reset, yeah. That was nice. But that, that's an instant death. If, cool. if, you, if the door is closed. That was so fucking closed. So does he just go away now for the rest of this? No, no. he resets. I believe. Hey, girl. Hey, dude. Alright, so only two. I got you, and I got you. Alright. Alright. Everything's cool now. We got 98 viewers right now, apparently. People love, people love the, the Freddy. Getting spooked. They love Freddy. And I guess if anybody is not a subscriber, this is the first time I have ever played this game. Subscribe to... Yeah, go ahead and subscribe to us. Smoctagon. Like, just know that you're watching, you're watching the... Oh, you're gonna run out of power. The version run here. No, it'll be fine. Good. It'll be fine. You know what? It's all gonna work out. All right. Kev keeps playing. Says if you click on Freddy's nose in the poster, it'll honk. I don't believe that. <laughs> all right. But then that summons him. All right. I'm feeling better now. Like this is getting my spirits up. There's you. The music's not all right with me. There's and you. Duck. You're still there. Okay, so he's. I think this guy's done for the rest of our game now. He's sleepy. Alright, 4 a.m. This is gonna be close. I mean, if your battery runs out, it's not insta lose, right? But you're just waiting. It, I mean, if it ran out now, you would be screwed. Right. Yeah, it's. Uh, it's... I, heard, I heard a footstep. 
Larry Vossler says, space money spook goop blue goop the gun. All right. Yep. He's right out there. Damn, a hundred. We got a hundred. Right there. I see you too, asshole. All this, all these 100 people are gonna get so spooked. I'm just gonna, it's gonna be a spook right as I'm like trying to get like an eyelash out of my eye. I'm <laughs> and gonna, like, you're, gonna lose, my, you're gonna lose an eye. Just gonna poke my eye out. I mean, if I could make it to 5 a.m. with 20%, that's still the fraction is in my favor. Someone's walking. Yeah, there's too much noise. Oh, okay. Hey, buddy. All right. We got eyes on everyone? Okay, 19%, 5 a.m. That's that's not an okay noise. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right. All right. All right. All right, give me one more honk. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> now that, uh... Oh, he's... He's, he's, he's moving... Oh, oh shit, yeah. Fuck. Uh, that might be the end of you. Can you... Could you sh I could shut the door and be like... Uh, you, you wouldn't have all your power till the end, I don't think. But we're so close. I was saying, if you're not on camera, can you hear him coming? Because like, you'd hear him running when he was in that camera shot. I, I don't know. I think each camera has its own audio, because there's that one that's audio only. Right. That's him there, right? He's still hanging out. And this motherfucker is right outside the door here. Mama well, Hato says five December's at Derek's. Oh, oh wow, 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 wow. Wow, 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 godlike. Godlike. Freddy Freddy just got body. How's he doing? Got, how's he doing? Can you go one more day? You gonna try another day? I'll try it. I will not do this one. I will die here. But I, Derek, I believe in you. I think this is when all three of them start coming out. Come on, Tobin. Let's let's lay hands on Derek. You know about the laying of hands. Mm. Give you a nice head massage. Is that, is, how, is that how they do the laying of hands at your, at your church? Just head massage. Mm. You know, just infuse them with the Holy Spirit, and then yeah. also some some pos oh, pos already out. Vibes. She is oh, you <laughs> doing it. Hey, you're doing great. Soda. Most people don't laugh for so you shot up. Luckily, spit it out in fear. <laughs> I thought I had my camera on that guy, and he still managed to uh, start moving out. So is he, is he like a boo in Mario? Like he can't move if you're watching him? I that's, think that's so. what I've heard is that it has to do with him. Like he doesn't like the camera on it. But does that irritate him? <laughs> Who knows? Like, man. what does that mean? That can be interpreted two ways. It's video games. The the chat's going crazy right now. Ten Tuesdays at Tobin's, eight days at Eddie's. <laughs> Fortnite at Frankie's. Wife, well, no, I called you Dark. <laughs> Something like dark. Ten Tuesdays at Tobin's. That's a lot. That's a lot of Tuesdays. That's like a Tuesdays. fifth of a year. Probably play some video games. Wait a minute. Where'd she go? Oh, uh, I was so ready for you to just be fucked. <laughs> I was ready for you to be fucked there. Get bodied right away? Yep. What are you doing to me? What are you doing? Calvin, stop sitting on the remote. Oh no. What are you sorry. doing? You folks uh, at home can't tell Calvin is I'm trying sorry. to fucking. This is the end. This is how Derek What are you dies. talking about? I didn't do anything, Derek. You're, you imagined it. Oh, that's so that's the spookiest thing. <laughs> Oh, this guy is out. doing some shit, and she's down here. This is a bad situation. They're <laughs> getting real aggressive. Gonna have to close both doors. Mm. Oh, it's not even two, two o'clock yet. <laughs> like, and the wolf guy doesn't like hang out. You have to see him coming on the can. Uh oh, 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 fuck, fuck, you're fucked, you're fucked. 
Check the light. Damn, motherfucker, I think you're good. Is he back in this? So you you have Jesus, some, and he's already peeking out. You again. have some time. So that's Freddy. That's Freddy, right? The main. Uh, Freddy you know, is Freddy the bear. Freddy is this guy over so here. So who's this Foxy fellow? He's it's Foxy. No, put you up. Okay, she's back. Okay, she's back the, there. She's Those the two are still hanging out, and then you're right there. All right. Oh, God. I need to chill the fuck out. It's like two o'clock. Come on, Derek. Just... Yeah. 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 All right. Let go. Let go. Too much. I need this. You, 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 you don't need that hand. Give <laughs> you one on the nose. Yeah. Ooh, people are saying you're good at video games, Derek. Someone's got to be in this. <laughs> Where? Oh, oh, shit. Where'd Birdo go? In the kitchen? Sodas? I mean, it could be in the room that's audio only, right? That's the kitchen. I don't know where the fuck she is. Alright. I don't know where Yellow's at. Shit. Okay, well, obviously you need to check the lights again. Like that much noise, I'm not alright with. I'm not convinced that yeah. it is actually it might just means be like anything. ambient kind of. Yeah, thing. I think that's just a, a sound that plays. Yeah. There we go. There she is. All she right. must be hanging out in the kitchen. You're yeah. still there. And you guys are still hanging out, so alright. What are you guys doing? Pretty good. Alright? Yeah. Some of the chat says if you click on Foxy's nose in the poster, you get 10% more power. But Foxy isn't in the poster. It's just our three main characters. You guys are goofing us. We're trying to goof us. And we're trying to get spooked, trying to goof. It's not right. Or is Foxy like secretly in the picture? We can't tell. Yeah. I like that sweet flying beat guitar the rabbit's playing. Mm -hmm. oh! What's up? What's up, buddy? What's up, what's up Home Slice? 3 a.m., 49%. Kind of riding that line. Mm. Yeah, but if you have to hold that door down for any amount of time. Yeah, I, that, that's. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Retro's twenty six hundred says five fingers of death punch. <laughs> Come on, Derek. You're just mad you didn't think. Hey, what's up? I'm doing shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be fucking bothered with jokes. I thought it said save me. It's me. What if it was saying the same thing? Uh, I'm naked and I'm far from home. Uh, Dakimura Music we says... We got a whole brigade loose. Oh, Dakimura wow. Music says, if you click Derek's nose in the screen on your monitor, your comp will get more RAM. Okay, I don't know where nose. none of y'all's is at. <laughs> I... Mm. Let's get real in here. Mm. That's not an okay noise. Mm -hmm. Obviously. Uh, yep. Yo, girl. Yo, girl. Yo, girl. Fuck off. Get out of here. Okay. Okay, you're still cool. <laughs> I like how the uh, images aren't different, so you can't tell if they're coming or going. You know? Yeah. Backstage, show stage. I still haven't seen. I've seen Fred. Oh, Freddy. she moved. I've seen Frederick. Right here, she's back there. He's back there. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know where Freddy is. What? She's on the move. She is. What's happening? I need everyone in the chat to clap their hands for Derek right now. 4 a.m., 22% power. Yeah, something in that long hallway. Yeah, that light. Alright. 5 a.m.
stretch here. This game came out last year? Earlier this year, maybe. Yeah, I think so. I don't like that noise. Any of them are. Great. I maybe I'm just not seeing shit because I'm adrenaline's going through me right now. But I, <laughs> I did not spot any of them. Are they all just having a pal out in the kitchen where you can't hear? Uh, oh, came, you can only. Hey, girl. It go. came out in uh, August of this year. Oh, you got movement. Some squawking. How fast do these guys move? I think in this stage, slow-ish. I want to say by the end, they move. I, I was under the impression it was a healthy challenge. Yeah, I've heard it's like really tough to actually beat the game. And then there's a secret. Oh man, Derek, Good can you it. go one more? Yeah. Can you handle one more? Can you handle one more? Can the viewer. What do you think? What, what time is it? Uh, it is 9:15. We are, so we're just at the two-hour mark here. And and we still have the mystery game to play. You know what? I think I'm going to retire as the greatest uh, Five Nights right. at Freddy's player uh, of all time. On those right-hand buttons on there, can, can you... Just do it do with the, yeah, the rope it open. Let's switch it switch around. Oh, man. Whew. Hey, ask Fuji, Derek. Not very. I, I'm, I'm, you got that adrenaline pump. Yeah, now I'm, like, ready to run a marathon. <laughs> what if you were by yourself in the dark? Ooh. How would that feel? Uh, are we playing Alone in the Dark, the original? No, we are not. We're Derek. playing Alone in the Dark, the Nightbringer. Oh! Mmm! Ah, oh, people giving me some love in the chat, that's nice. I guess we gotta come back to it? We got it, you gotta beat the game. Uh, TV remote. Oh, yes. I'll tell you what, you gonna set the... I need some water! <laughs> Well, Derek, before uh, before you go, I want to you know show you what game we're playing, because I'm the only one who knows what game we're playing. That's right. It's a secret. You yeah. Tell me. So, I had it for a little bit and just popped it in this. We we've actually played it before. This little game. It's called call Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> no. <laughs> the spookiest game. Oh, good. The spookiest game. Are we really doing this right we're now? We're doing this right now, Derek. <laughs> it's too real. Too All right, let's update this. <laughs> Sonic the. We got a hundred viewers on them, on, on, it? on playing Five Nights at Freddy's. We're gonna get a hundred more <laughs> playing Sonic the fucking Hedgehog, son. Sonic the Hedgehog. It doesn't. Oh, I'm also spelling Hedgehog. <laughs> Sega. But it's a Sega joint, y'all. You heard a Sega? Yeah. Sega. They made my favorite action RPG, Alpha Protocol. <laughs> there's, there's no way to. We're just playing Sonic the Hedgehog. We're just playing Sonic the Hedgehog. Let's load up my saved data from Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, you know what? 12 21 2013. I saw that. I don't remember that one. Rolling around at the speed of sound, you're goddamn right. I mean, we could keep going with my Sonic playthrough or we could start my Shadow playthrough. Let's keep going with Sonic. He's the fastest thing on two feet. The, the blue bomber himself. Oh, yeah. Uh, it is 9. Uh, PM in Alaska. No I, I matter can where confirm. we go, all we see are ruins. How can this be our future? These terrifying monsters <laughs> will haunt How my dreams forever. <laughs> What's in that cold that room? True? If I eliminate that guy, will our world be saved? What? Yes. <laughs> the day of disaster. <laughs> Here are my records of this event. Sounds like Calvin playing at moves. <laughs> this was when Iblis was free and his was flames free. were released into the world. The, the contrast between these ridiculous looking characters and this real world that they are putting them in. I just want to go fast, yo. You have to. You literally have I to. I gotta go fast. Jesus, let's get it moving. Flame core. Flame core. Flame core. It's that new, uh, that new genre. I'm in the, I'm in the post flame core. Really. Flames. That's how it goes. 
So we just light a guitar on fire and you try and play it? <laughs> yeah. So that's why I was like, smaller core better. <laughs> we, have, we now have less than 100 view viewers. I just Can't, wanted... imagine why. Can't imagine why I did leave. <laughs> we seriously lost like 20 people. <laughs> uh, Look, like... he's in a spooky forest mountain. Place. Guys, it's spooky. Oh, Look at this. Look at that monster. monster. I got him. Whoa, two loop de loops? You gonna go on Woo. both of them? Can you just like run off the edge? Yeah, absolutely, and you what will you? all the time. What of you? What of you? Yeah. Yeah, there's a great camera I've already had. Alright, now I should press buttons. <laughs> yep, gotta be careful. Tom, did you switch to first person view or? Oh! If I use a homing attack on that monster, I'll be able to reach the other side. <laughs> oh, well. Yes. Use a homing attack because this game is best when it plays itself. Oh no! Yep. Oh no! Come on, Sonic. Come on. Use the homing attack. Is that working? No. You didn't chili dog him, all right? <laughs> Come on. Come on. Oh. Hot dog in it right now, that's for sure. I, don't, I do like how it reloads real quick. Okay, we're actually getting more. Oh, okay, the number is going up again a little Good. bit. Good. <laughs> we went down to 10. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Shit. That's what PewDiePie does in this shit. I get it now. I'm sorry, Pewds. I'm sorry, Pewter Pie. Just trying to get that PewDiePie money. What do you do? I don't. Bad games. Let's see if I can. It's weird that he calls it a homie attack. Like, what's the. What's the. Whoops. I guess that's just the edge. It's not like you're shooting missiles so they have holy missiles. Uh, well, uh... Who put those boxes there? Well, Sonic the Hedgehog is Captain blue, America, is the, blue, the blue missile. Yes. So I got five rings, guys. Aren't you proud of me? So, great game. God damn it. Close. Sonic is back. Everybody. Like they were that's how they that's how they were like advertising this game. This game like, is just called Sonic the Hedgehog. Because we're bringing it back. We're taking Sonic to the next generation. Don't yeah. they don't they do that for basically every Sonic game? Like Sonic's back. Like implying that the last game was garbage and we're sorry. Yeah. He, he fixed he's back and he fixed it. That, that's because Sonic is back. Just shoot lava shooter, shoot up from the fiery ground. Right there, because you're of the school that I've thought that like Sonic was never actually a good game. It was no. just different enough at the time that people latched onto it. It was uh, all, it was it was all style and very little substance, but such a triumph of style that it, it you know um, did very very well for itself. And you know the first Sonic, the first two Sonic games on Genesis are kind of enjoyable, but like no, I I kind of think Sonic just was never really good. Uh, regardless of that, though, Sonic certainly has not been good right. in a very long time. People are always like, no, Sonic Adventure was good. No, it wasn't. Sonic Adventure. No. So it was good for its time. Like, this was not even good for its time. You can give Sonic Adventure a, a little bit of credit and be like, yeah, when it first came out, everybody was just flipping out. Like, when you were running down the dock and the whale was chasing you, yeah. that was fucking amazing. Yes. Use the footing that comes floating along with the lava flow. Of course. Can you explain it? Yes. I did it. Guys, I'm, I'm, I'm the best. I'm Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes. Running around at the speed of sound. Fences are online. That was my that was my It's hard to express how horribly this game controls. It's like, it seems like the camera's just barely, but not even really good. Like, this is when it controls the best, and I just press X to jump on everyone. No! He got me. He got me, guys. That's snake. It just, it looks so oh, weird. Everything is like... Collapse any minute. Lava and, and dark, and then we have these bright red and yellow yeah, and blue. Like, 
Like, the design wise, it looks like shit. Yeah, it's, but it's just like this. No, we need to keep this going because that's what the, the things look like. Stuff in the Sonic universe. That's the color they are. Is it ever just speed on a speed run on this game? Yeah, and then, like, if you glitch it in a certain way, you'll just teleport to the end credits. What? Yep. There, there, there's actually a really good, like, five, five minute speed run uh, of the last awesome game, Done Quick. It's not really a speed run, it's just. I mean, it's it's non tool assistant, like, the guy does it with the controller. Five. Those, those speed runs are really interesting, but I feel like. They're not quite as interesting as somebody who has just gotten extremely good at the game. Yeah, yeah that, and that would be super impressive with this game, considering how shitty it is. I gotta kill all these lava dogs, which is horrible. Uh, someone was talking about, like, Lost Worlds. And I was sort of excited about Lost Worlds. Because they were trying to basically oh, make that, like, some... a weird fantasy one? I, I don't know. It, it was basically Mario uh, Galaxy. And it was like, well, last, you were running down lots of, like, columns and, it's, and cylinders and stuff like that. Just, oh, like, right, right, right. I remember that. And it, it looked like it was something interesting and different. And I was like, oh, I would be kind of... I'd like to see that. And then... Um, I guess Generations was alright. Yeah. Um, I pressed the button. I didn't mean to press. This bridge is gonna collapse any minute! I'll collapse you, Sonic. Use the foot that comes floating along. Oh shit, I should use the things the lava flow. It's a game like lost in tradition. It's like you know a holiday that people like celebrate, but like the culture has forgotten why it celebrates it or why a war has gone on, but like nobody remembers what started the war. George W. Bush. Um, but it's just like they keep making Sonic games and they still have this small set of rules of attributes. Like it, it has to meet these criteria to be a Sonic game. And I feel like most of those you need to be like, no, you have to. You have to break Sonic down so much further and, and rebuild it. Like, like there's, there's there's too much of the old Sonic they just can't let go. Like and they, this idea they, that that's the reason why the classics work. They just need to lean into like the super like on rail stuff, and they just need to make a Sonic game that plays like a Sirius Rap. We need a wrestling game that plays like a Sirius Rap and a Sonic game that plays like a Sirius Rap. You know, everything will be hunky dory. I mean, this game works best when it is based, which is a quick time yeah. event. Or when you go forward and you're just pushing and the Sonic's going... The, the Sonic... What the fuck?! The Sonic conundrum is really interesting, but it's just such a tragic tale, how... But I guess, like, these games still make money, but they still make them. Let's do it. Sure am Sonic. <laughs> Somebody asked if I'm comparing this game to a lottery, and then somebody chimed in. Uh, that's not true. Sometimes in a lottery you win. Oh! No one wins when they play Sonic 2006. That's the chat. I'll tell you, man, this shit is like a war. Yes. Can't even call this shit a war. Why not? Wars end. <laughs> Shout out to the wire. Shout out to the... <laughs> you get back to making more wire jokes on this show. Bring, you know, that, that box is... Go out of nowhere. All right, Calvin, you've got to turn this shit off. What are you talking about? I'm having a great time. Let me see if I can get past this one stupid purple room. <laughs> you have already. No, I haven't. No, every, every, time, every time the motherfucker shoots me. I, I, I think no. the, the very first time you did get past it. No, you're thinking of an identical purple room that I got past. <laughs> Derek. Derek. Look, what's real? What's Sonic, even real? Sonic is real. The real is chili dogs. Chili dogs are real. He's real ass chili dogs. Why isn't this door open yet? Have they ever incorporated the chili dogs in the video game? Or was that just a comic thing? Comic in the cartoon, I think. Alright, you got it. Alright. I don't even care about getting all these things. I did it, guys. Oh, here's the, here's the save. Oh, yeah, like, now, now I just beat the game. Let's go on the chat. Having a chat. Why would you do that? There is a Sonic RPG that BioWare made. Yeah. What? 
Yes. The fuck? Violet yes. Yes. <laughs> In between an RPG, Mass Effect games. But before Mass Effect came out, I forget, but yeah. Was it like a phone game or something? DS. I, mean, I never knew Dark about Dark Brotherhood. This. Sure, bounce me around. Woo. Son of a bitch. Woo. Son of a bitch. Hey, get off the thing so I can bounce more. No! So you tripped. You tripped on a crater. I actually do have to get... I, I have tapes to return to the video store by 10 o'clock, now. Actually, have All right, to let me die, let me die one more time. Just jump off. Oh, wow, wow, next level. See this? See these moves? You see these moves? Derek, do you see these moves? Do you see these moves? Derek! Look at these moves. Do you see these moves? Look at these moves. Do you see these moves? That's the game. Guys, guys, we're Sonic here. Holy shit. We're Sonic here. Sonic, yo, spring! <laughs> we're Sonic here. Well, all right, guys. Thanks for joining us. Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't know about you, Derek, mm -hmm. and I know you're real busy. I'd like to get out one more spooky game stream before Halloween proper. I. You might have to do team up with Tobes. Hey, Tobin. You want to come over and watch me play Deadly Premonition? I, I might be too bad. Yeah? 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 I mean, I have no interest in watching you play that game. I mean, uh, you have more interest in watching Calvin play than you have in yourself. <laughs> yeah, you don't Yes, play. I've already been down that road. I'm not going back. Cool. Well, thanks for joining us, guys. Yeah. Uh, next Monday, Derek's going to be doing Stop Skeletons. Something not Halloween related, which is unthinkable. Might still be Halloween related. <gasps> Damn, exclusive. I think you gotta keep going with it. Why stop now? Why stop now? Oh, guys, there's a timer running. I'm not gonna get the highest score in Sonic. Oh, Calvin, your speedrun is ruined. Okay, guys, stop the stream. Bye, guys. All right, bye, everybody.